Yeah, We're back hanging with money. D.L. Hughley. D.L. Hughley breaks the news on CNN Saturday and Sunday nights at 10 p.m. And, Bobby, you were, like, uh, cracking up the live audience during the break. What was no, that about? It had nothing to do with me. We're all laughing together. At this, I, 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 David... Uh, this when you when you tap him or hit him on the shoulder, like you know, hey, get me whatever. Yeah, he has a twitch. He has a twitch. There's something happened with his mouth. It just twitches every <clears> time <throat> you hit him, <clears throat> and it's like it, his lip goes down or it goes up. Really, something happens with his face. Like it's not the skin on his head isn't connected to his. <laughs> skull. Oh, here's David. <laughs> hi, young David. And it's the funniest thing hey, I've David, ever seen. Say hi to D.L. Hughley. Very how you funny doing, man. Daddy? You all right? Nice to meet you, sir. Nice to meet you. Do too, you know sir. who he is? I oh. certainly do know who oh, he is, yes. Yeah, I what do you know about him? It's, it's almost an Elvis snarl. Yeah, keep, right. yeah, watch this, David. Stay there. Stay there. Look at Opie. Look at Opie. Look over there. Watch. Wait. Oh. So you gonna no. beat the shit out of him until he twitches? Uh, uh, oh, yeah, he did do a little... He does this little thing with his mouth. Look at Danny. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no. Okay, I just saw that one. <laughs> like a dog. He goes, eh, uh. God, hey, man, you, you get too close to a dog and they, they <laughs> show the teeth. Yeah, like, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you leaving with me, I'm taking you out of this bullshit. Okay. Right? Yeah, <laughs> this is sweet. All right. Sweet? Sweet. Wow. You got a question for DL? Sure. How do you like being on CNN? Uh, that's, I, I, I like it a lot, man. He hates it. I, I like what it a lot. What do you think? Now, uh, uh, what do you what do you want to do? Like you are, I'm getting trying to get into radio broadcasting. So you, you let people. The good way is not to let the people beat the shit out of you. <laughs> 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 it's like going to prison. You can't let somebody fuck you and then want respect. So you got to do it. <laughs> now you got to beat up. Bobby. Now you got to beat up. Bobby. So yeah. why don't you go? Beat I'm just up fucking Bobby. around because you look like you'll do it. He said to kill. <laughs> He's like, all right, all right. <laughs> Bobby, will fucking rip you his head like off. A nice guy. Where you from? Then I'll Jersey. Jersey. Jer Jerusalem. <laughs> He's Jewish. He could not the be more Jewish. From Jerusalem, man. He's Jewish, but he doesn't know much about being a Jew. He gets it wrong every time. No. Well, no, some people say he gets it wrong, but a lot of people say he gets it wrong. <laughs> Somebody was bitching that the thing you said about the Festival of Lights uh, wasn't true. Yeah. Like that. Uh, That's true. The Greeks. The Greeks, the Romans. What well, is it the Greeks or the Romans? It's the There's Romans. Kind of a difference there. It was the Romans? What that? Yeah. It's the Romans. Yeah. And yep. what did they do? They kind of they destroyed the um, the holy temple of the Jews. Yeah. And they and there was one bottle of oil, and the Jews thought that it wasn't going to last enough to light the up the oil whole, story for a little, only for one night, and it lasted for eight days. Yeah, we know. Yeah, that's it. The same thing. Yeah. So where's the so suffering that's... part coming? Because there's got to be some there's suffering. There's no suffering. There's no suffering. The suffering no. is that the temple was destroyed. <laughs> oh. And all their homes and stuff was all destroyed. The Romans destroyed all the homes and everyone, all their property and their land and everything. Better gifts first day or last day of Hanukkah. Last day, it has to be. Is it? They saved the best for last. No, in my house is only gifts on one day. What? I don't get gifts every day. <laughs> he does do that. I don't get gifts every day. No. But aren't you supposed to get eight days of gifts? No, that's a myth. What? I, I think that's eight. Kwanzaa. Is that Kwanzaa? I'm all confused. I think that's Kwanzaa. I don't get gifts every day. I thought, I thought that the Jews oh. gave a gift every day of Hanukkah. That's something yeah. I know from you when to, I... No, you have to light the candle every day. You yeah, get, but then there's a little no, gift that's given. you're supposed to get a given. gift every day. Oh, really? No, Spread it out. Yeah. There's only one day when there's like real gift, like a real gift, and then other days are like little like what? gradles or Hanukkah gifts, or little, like you said before, little like... How many, crap. Do, How many yeah. gradles do you have? Too many to count. Really? Do you ever play dreidel? When I was a lot younger in school, I used to play dreidel, and then, like the winners. How, like, do, you, how do you play dreidel? I'm not, I'm Is it like Yahtzee? No, it's like a little thing, and you spin. Dreidel, you... dreidel, dreidel. How does I it made it out of a, clay. <laughs> Even like, I know that song. And yeah, yeah, I know. I, and until I was twenty-five, what the fuck is a dreidel? Yeah, yeah. dreidel. It, oh, it, how, it's how? like a. It's like shooting dice. <laughs> <Not> exactly. <laughs> Something. Yeah. I just, uh, there's like a dreidel and there's three letters on and one of them is me and there's a pot of like the Hanukkah gelt that we talked about before and if it lands on one letter you get everything in the pot if it lands on another letter you get nothing in the pot Sounds if it lands Jewish on a different letter you get like some of the gelt in the pot <laughs> you get everything <laughs> yeah and if it lands so, on a certain letter, you, you run the, the media. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> what, did, what did you say, man? I, I said something horribly stereotypical. <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> what? Uh, so <laughs> this is horrible, man. <laughs> hey, man. <laughs> what the hell's going look on right here? Look at the. He's got to go on right here. Yeah, you, man. Listen to me. Some people have to suck cock in jail. <laughs> oh <laughs> shit! Yeah, it really happens. Yeah, you the chicken? You the, you the rooster or the hen? That's kind of how. Yeah. What are you? Uh, uh, are you going to be the hen or the rooster? 
What do you think? <laughs> I mean, you could at least have to do with the red fruit. Yeah, you could man. smack the shit that out of, yeah, out of Sam. You can at take least, Sam, yeah. but he's my bitch, so you got to go through I me. You can <laughs> yeah, you, it's going to cost you some cigarettes. <laughs> DL, <laughs> DL, you want to oh see, see something creepy? Go ahead, Sam. Go over to Bobby. Let Bobby work you over a little Get bit. Over, wait, stop. Sit. Stay. Over here. <laughs> Come, here. Gonna be like, Come here. Come here. What Sit. the fuck y'all got going Sit. on here? Down. Bobby runs down. this place. Bobby, down. Bobby loves Sam. Now, don't look at him in the eye. Down. <laughs> Give me paw. Now, suck on your knuckle. Suck Goodness on gracious. Kiss so it. you can actually own a white dude? Yeah. <laughs> See. Well, he's, he I don't have a problem with that. Wait a second. Obama's <laughs> president now. He's half black. You can own a black guy again. <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> The black and white guy. Look, Look at, at that you. afro. You think he's what, yeah, white? I was yeah, like, man, something in there. Months, something. Somebody was well, with somebody. That, my hair is like that. I went into CNN. I said, you got something for my hair? We got electricity and tape. <laughs> <laughs> and That's tape. all we got. And I was like, tape. Sam's related to Thomas Jefferson. Right, get up. For I'm, real. Are you really? Yeah. For real. Look really? at you. Thomas Jefferson. And I think I think he's related because of one of the Tom's trips out back one night, <laughs> uh, which he was known to uh, to do. Hey, right. man, hey man, so you 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 uh, this is what you got to do to get in the radio, huh? Mm -hmm. This is the story. That's what yeah. you got to do. The, uh, yeah, yeah. Why don't you right. tell Sam well, to stop? It. Yeah, yeah. Stand up, David. Yeah, you David. don't have to. You don't have to take that shit from Sam. Yeah, Sam, that's you don't have to sure. take it from Sam. Yeah. Bobby, you do. Yeah, what are you gonna do, Dave? There's some shit you gotta stop. Yeah, yeah. you gotta stop grabbing by his hair. You can't suck everybody's cock in right. jail. Bobby's the <laughs> Bobby's <laughs> the guy. You have to suck your cock. Bobby's the guy like benching the entire fucking stack of weights, <laughs> and uh, Sam is just some fucking bitch. What's that? <laughs> Sam's the, no, Sam's the guy that gets you whatever you need in jail. Right. And let's see yeah. if we can get this done, though. Intern David, tell Sam to stop, and let's see what tell happens him. here. Tell him. Tell him you don't like that shit. Yeah. Tell him. Let's you don't go. Want him hitting you. Okay. Sam, could you please stop tapping me on yeah, the shoulder? Yeah, but like you nah, say it like you mean it. Hey, dude. Can I, you please stop fucking me in the <laughs> ass? Wait, wait, wait a second. Right, what is DL, that? DL, you show him what okay, you mean. Okay, come on. Oh, shit. All right. No, no, okay, let me show you. Set, go, Sam. 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 Now put some bass in your butt. <laughs> and, and it's, look, I got to, it's always nice to throw a motherfucker on ass me. Say that. Sam. No, no, that's not the same thing I said. <laughs> All right. You got to fuck Sam. Now just say it exactly like I said. Look him in the eyes. Okay. And say, motherfucker, unass me. Un what? Ask me. Unass un me. Un me. Just look, look him in the eyes. Okay. Look him in, like, like you mean it. Okay. Motherfucker, unass me. That's right. how you do it. Oh, oh, damn. Shit. Holy okay. shit. Oh, that's how you do it. That's, that's it. it. That's how you do it. Hey, all right. Unass me. <laughs> that's how you do it. Wow. Un that shit only works me. in the studio. <laughs> Like yeah. I used to, I used to think I knew karate because I watched kung fu, yeah. and that shit don't work for real. <laughs> no, I got my ass kicked, but <laughs> motherfucker, unass me. <laughs> That's it, man. So you know, and and don't look around like you nervous. You yeah, yeah, around. right in the yeah, eyes. Get that, That's see, it, David. David, see that little eleven you create in your face? <laughs> <laughs> I'll, yeah. do, I'll do that eleven. I'll do that. All right. That is permanent. Up. Yeah, you have is. a permanent little scowl, like. Fuck. You have a permanent disappointed face. <laughs> <laughs> that, that number eleven. That's perfect. That's oh, oh, David, David. Sam, are you threatened by Dave? I wasn't before. <laughs> yeah. Now, see? All this unasked me talk has got me concerned. He right. puts you in in your place. Now, now, intern David, freestyle a little bit. Take what DL yeah. gave you and let's and, see what he got. Embellish now. it. Let's go. Let's go. Add your own spice. Oh, uh, you, Sam, you, why don't you hit him first? Yeah, give him a little. Hit him, hit him. Hey, Sam, what are you doing to me? I don't want to. I don't want to see this from you anymore, Sam. <laughs> <laughs> <What>? <laughs> That's a far cry from Jesus. motherfucker. Unask me. How did, you, how did you devolve so quickly? <laughs> hey, you turned into a fucking <laughs> manager. Hey, 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 hey. Dave is Adam. Dave is mom. Adam Sandler oh, and Airheads trying to be mean. Whoever saw Airheads is gonna like that. Oh, my oh goodness. Jesus. Uh, okay. Well, Sam. you know what? Don't get one of those very it's often. It's not in you, man. <laughs> no, it's not in you. I think it is, Dio. Well, you gotta, you brought yeah. it out of him. We just yeah. gotta get it to where it's on the is surface. He, is he, he's not serious that he's like this for real, right? No, yeah. no. He is. he is. That's the beauty of him. Are you serious? Sam, give what do you think? We Sam, hired an actor to be a Jew? <laughs> <laughs> All right. Hi, how are Central you? Central casting. No, right. we need more. Oh, my God. My name is David. <laughs> I look miserable. All right, give now, me a good David. Give me a good How old are you, man? 26. You're 26. When's your birthday? August. August. Mm -hmm. August. In, any day in August? Are you 21. Just, so August 21. Yeah. Hey, man, don't let that motherfucker do that to you, man. You better watch yourself, Sam. <laughs> <laughs> or what? Or what? This is getting worse. Yeah, or <laughs> what? Or what? <laughs> or Get what? mad, David. Come on, There'll David. be a lot of shit coming your way, Sam. You better watch yourself. 
Oh, oh, yeah. oh yeah. Yeah. Damn, a lot of shit coming yeah. his way. David, oh my David God. you oh forgot my God. rule number one. He used the word motherfucker. Right. Yeah, yeah. Get back to motherfucker. Always, always right. use motherfucker. That's where you lost this. Hey, you motherfucker. You better watch it. See? Yeah, yeah. but you can't throw you better watch it and motherfucker. No, you like, gotta like, yeah, yeah. you gotta just. Because he's just gonna say Don't ever watch. finish a word. Right. Just don't finish any more of your words. Not even motherfucker. Just not, don't finish a word. And look at him in the eye. You, yeah. if you, this is, uh, uh, this is not gonna work. Okay, try it again. Go, motherfucker. What are you doing? No. Push him. See, I told you not <laughs> to push him. <laughs> you. Don't ask him yeah, questions. You're asking him questions that now, he has now, answers this, for. This is what is gonna happen. When I, I'm gonna read about David snapping and killing all you motherfuckers. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> You're gonna have a good and laugh. I am though. gonna go, wow. I knew it. And these, because dudes like he's this, gonna snap. Do, and he's laughing yeah. now. You, it's funny. <laughs> You're just gonna see a YouTube video of right. David with right. fucking two AKs. I'm right. a lead for my motherfucker. <laughs> and then I gotta testify. I kind of thought it would happen. I knew it. I, I was I in there that day. Happen. They were pushing him around. And, and, and you know, right, I knew it David, try, try. One now, more time, David. The motherfucker, maybe he's gotta be angry like a white guy. You gotta, like, more Yeah, something. Maybe something you could do. Dude, I will fucking rip your head off and shit good. down your fucking throat. Yeah, let's see how this ends. Try that. Let's go. Oh, I gotta say that. Watch. Well, just okay. something like that. Yeah, just okay. make sure you make just it up snap. yourself. Rage. White guys use rage. Sam's pushing. Motherfucker. <laughs> That's it. Go. You don't what? smile after you say motherfucker. <laughs> well, I, I think I think the problem is, is the point you is? you can't have a windbreaker and glasses on. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> Like, you never seen nobody win a fight with a windbreaker. No, on. take off the take crossing off the guard windbreaker. jacket. Right. Yeah. All right. There I you go. Take, take off. You need the glasses. Yes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, well, no I, you actually don't need the glasses. I do. To see? Can I ask, well, yeah. can I ask intern David so I'm like, everyone has a fake karate move they go into to maybe oh, right. intimidate. Right. Yeah, right. Right. physical right. intimidation. What, what would be your, like, look, you know, I'm going to do this to show that I might uh, have uh, some, some skills. What's Fighting your move? skills. Right. What's your move? There you go. Right. There you Backwards go. hat. Go a there you go. Backwards better. hat going on. A little better. <laughs> All right. Sam, push him. No, 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 no. Don't put... You don't want to put your head backwards and bangs in the front. You're, <laughs> you're never scared of a dude with bangs. <laughs> like that. You can't have that. There you go. There you go. There you go. We're, we're going to toughen you up. Yeah. yeah. All right. What's, right. Your, what's your karate kind of like, you know, your stance where you... Get into like a fighting stance and threaten him verbally. Yeah. All right. Sam, go ahead. Motherfucker, what are you doing, man? I got shit on you. No, no, no. David, you don't shit on me. No, you don't shit. Oh, my God. David, David. David, David, David. Hey, David, David. I'm going I'm, I'm gonna, I'm gonna to hire a bodyguard for you. Oh, my God. Because you know what? You are an innocent soul, and fuck these people, man. I'm going to shit on you. Put your windbreaker on. Do you have a $6 million man lunchbox? I'm telling you, man. I don't condone any of this bullshit. You understand what I'm saying? Oh, so put the damn. fucking windbreaker yeah. on. You're coming with me. We're going to get some black eyed peas and shit. Come on. <laughs> you coming with me because you can't be out in the, on the yard by yourself. <laughs> no. <laughs> no. You're going to be kind of like my bitch, but I won't actually fuck you. You just come on. <laughs> just put your jacket on. You coming with me. Sam, were you give scared? Give me this windbreaker. I was a little scared hey. that he was going to shit on me. Listen, yeah. David. Who wants to be shit on? David, that would be gross. DL's gonna, you're going to be yeah, DL's yeah, yeah. bitch, but you're going to have to do his taxes right. for him. Yeah. yeah. That's <laughs> 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 but that's how you're gonna get out of prison too. <laughs> Damn. Oh man. my god. Motherfucker. Have you ever, have you ever honestly, on you. let me ask you something. You 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 never had a fight ever in your life? Ever? No. Never? Have you ever got laid ever? No. They're almost the same thing. Yeah. Almost the same thing. <laughs> Jesus. They're almost the same thing. That's great. Thing. You're gonna have you're gonna see him in the news, he beat up a pussy. <laughs> <laughs> started flailing, <laughs> spitting Wait, on I it. forgot what I, We Call don't know what he was, but he had a yellow windbreaker on. <laughs> and he kept going, I'll shit on you, you motherfucker. <laughs> Where do you get a yellow windbreaker? I bought it. At American Eagle. Oh. The, 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 but I didn't even I've been to American Eagle. They must have They have this, yeah. In the back? They're hiding in the back. Yeah. It's a you got years something ago, yellow. Yeah. I was saving this for David, but you can have it. Right. From the David collection. <laughs> <laughs> From the, my dad doesn't want me to get hit by a car at night. <laughs>
I know. It's just like and a school And you know it's horrible because now I'm fucking, I'm in it now. Yeah, I want to be in it. Oh, he's uh, pushing him again. Give Come me on, a jacket. David. David. David, go to Rage. It's a go nice to rage. jacket. One more. Go to Rage. It's a nice jacket. Yeah. Go hey, to Rage. Stop think you can have this jacket, motherfucker? There you go. Yeah, yeah I do. Try to good. take the jacket, yeah, Sam. Sam, take his jacket. Take his jacket. You're coming after me, man? You ain't never going to have this jacket. That's it, David. You ain't never going to have this jacket, man. That's it. There you go. That's my jacket. Go to Rage. I'm going to fucking beat the shit out of you, man, if you keep touching me. Really? That's it. That's it. Really? Rage. <laughs> <laughs> I reiterate. You can't say anything. With, you can't emphasize. Really? You can't do that. I think, Why do y'all do this to this man? We, we gotta know. toughen him up, Dio. We do oh, have to toughen him up a little so bit. So how long have you been working here? Eleven o'clock. How long have you been working here? Since September. Since, how's it been going for you? It's going pretty well. I'm really? Doing, yeah, yeah. I'm, I'm, I'm enjoying it. I'm learning a lot of stuff about radio. Really? <laughs> yeah. yeah. What, what is the biggest lesson you've learned about radio? Watch this. <sighs> biggest learns like, lessons yeah. I've learned. Right. Yeah. This motherfucker. <laughs> I'm taking your glasses. Oh you shit! Oh shit! I always take your glasses. Oh, this like, uh, this is like, Why are you taking my glasses, motherfucker? I want these glasses. What are you gonna do with these glasses, motherfucker? These are my glasses. You don't ever touch them on the man's glasses. That's good. <laughs> I like them. Yeah, yeah that. <laughs> but I like the little rock 'em sock 'em robot punch you throw. <laughs> this this oh, shit should have ended God. in the third grade. <laughs> really? Like for everybody. Man. But and this, this is the same shit I used to sit and see in the, like, the third grade. Right. And Dave, it wouldn't be bad to push him back. He's pushed it a thousand yeah. times. Maybe a little pushback. At yeah. a certain point. Come yeah, on, at a certain yeah. point, Come you got to mean business. David, no, I, David, not a girly push. I right. got your back, David. Yeah, let's yeah. go. Don't worry, got we, got you. we got you. Let got me hold these glasses. We got you. Motherfucker, you don't touch my glasses. Let me hold these glasses. I got you. Oh, yeah. That was a good one. That was a good one. Push. Another push. Well, you can't ask for Don't Don't lean in like you're going to push and don't. Yeah. You got, yeah, yeah. You can't fake push him, motherfucker. Once you commit, <laughs> you got to go in. David, bite him. <laughs> Use those big chompers bite and bite him to Sam. You want to bite me? Bite him. Bite me. Bite oh, bite me. There you go. There you oh, go. There yeah, you go. Yeah, 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 yeah. Bite me then. They're happy for you that you're fighting back a little see, bit. See, you know, see, when you, when you, you there's no guarantee you're going to win. Right. People say shit like noble that is the man. You got to stand up a little yeah. bit. You probably gonna get your ass whooped a couple of times. Right. That's all I got. <laughs> <laughs> like, not even a light. Not even in a tunnel. <laughs> it's just you're always gonna get your ass kicked. Right. 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 But you'll have your yellow jacket. What if yeah. David, <laughs> David just snapped and knocked Sam out? Oh, he's oh, gone. I would to love to see UFC it. style yeah. out of nowhere. I would love right. to see a spinning back fist. <laughs> I'm, I'm over there crying over Sam's body. <laughs> <That's> like, <laughs> Fucking straighten that afro and, right out. <laughs> and David, what's your what's your like karate pose? Yeah, got so, have some. Oh yeah. You, right. you know what, Dave? Watch this. Sam, put your hand up like a glove, and Dave, sh throw a punch, and let's yeah. see what kind of punch, how yeah, hard your yeah, punch right. is. Throw a one-two. Yeah, one, two. Yeah, man, one, two. Do it, man. You ever do the? Uh, one, see two. boxers do that yes. when yes. they're Dave. sparring. Yes, I've seen. When yes. they're training. Let's see what you so got. So train Dave. on his hands. Just watch my palms. Don't worry. Put about your it. hands up first. Don't you don't bring them from your side. Let's see like how you fight. Six shooters. Yeah, go Since we can see how you fuck. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> He's little Joe from Bonanza. <laughs> <laughs> go. Oh my god. All right, guy, ready? One, two, one, two. Go. Come on. Eye of the tiger. Come on. Oh, that's pretty good. That was good. That's All right. Good. Oh, he's got a good right. That's, that's good. good. Right, right your left. Left. Jab, jab with your left. Jab with your jab left. With your jab with your left. Jab and again. Jab, jab, jab. Now, David, miss accidentally and knock the yeah. fuck out of him. <laughs> <laughs> right. And then, and then right. go, oops. <laughs> David's got a good uh, right hand does, there. Man. All right. There was absolutely no defense, so you would have been on the yeah, floor right. in a second. <laughs> but once you slide one of your punches, <laughs> your face is wide right. open. Yeah. If your opponent's face is made of paper, I can get a shot. <laughs> <laughs> Jesus. You just oppose the violence at any too, level, way. right? You just don't like violence at all. You can see that right car. Really oh, like I know. Right. Okay, I understand yeah. that. Jesus. I understand. Especially with the you're, yellow jacket. <laughs> right. Yeah. You know, people on you're a gentle soul, and that's what it is. Yeah, people yeah, don't, They good. don't appreciate that. He's a Gentile soul. <laughs> <laughs> that's all it is, man. So just all stay right. inside a lot. Like, we're going to get you an office somewhere where you're safe. <laughs> He's been able to go, you know, how many years, uh, 20, whatever you are, uh, that many years without getting into a fight, so, you know. Yeah, but that's because he won't fight, not because nobody tried yeah. to fight. <laughs> people, people try to fuck with you, and you just kind of walk away, turn the other cheek, as they say. Very much. Yeah. That's the story. What do you that's... say? Please don't beat me up? That's no, the he story. actually, he <laughs> rolled. You, you he... say, please don't beat me up? He I don't say that. He what do you say? I don't really say anything, man. I just kind of walk this away. This is what he does. He yeah. rolls up into that yellow jacket. <laughs> like one of those fucking armadillos. Like one of those bugs. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> just kind of 
Yeah. Well, you know, you know that you. That's like I used to see shit like that all the time. Oh the hell yeah! In school, and then at always. a certain point, you know that you like even the, at a certain point, humanity takes up. And you go, man, stop with the bullshit. Yeah. Like they get, you know that you are like against violence when people get exhausted from fucking with you. Like just yeah. Nah, I, just, I used to get uh, I used to get I'm fucked with fuck. all the time until one, I broke yep. my arm. I got a cast on it. And the kid who used to fuck with me all the time, he got me in a hallway, but I had the cast, so I just used the cast and bashed his fucking That's head fucking in. Do. Nice. And, uh, and, and I, then he kicked your ass. No, he ever. cried. He cried like a little baby. And I, I'd love to, me I'd again. love to hear one of these stories where the the little guy takes the bully. Finally knocks him the fuck out, and the next day the bully comes in and beats the living shit out of the <laughs> fucking <laughs> little guy. I, I got a story for you. <laughs> I got a story for you. <laughs> this dude named Kevin Ferguson he used to fuck with me all the time, right? And so one time he was taking his jacket off. Well, you know, we were going to fight, and I had had enough. I, I used to be you. I didn't have a jacket, and I had an afro. <laughs> and I didn't know what the fuck a dreidel was. But other than that, <laughs> and a, and we're almost the same. And a personality. Right, right, right. <laughs> so he took hair. his jacket off, and I Such realized that I could, uh, I, man, I fucked him up with that jacket on. And, I, right. man, he had a jacket around. Like, Wait, y'all take my jacket off. Fuck you. And I'm hitting him. And the next day, boy, that motherfucker didn't have that jacket and beat the shit out of me. Beats the shit beat out of him. Beat the fuck out of me. That's what happened. It, is, what it isn't always like But we never like fought the, anymore after that. Like, it isn't like the movies it. all the time. Yeah, you no, gotta where you beat up the big guy, guy and they're like, right. yeah. It's right. like, that motherfucker got lucky. Yeah. Right. He sucker punched me. I got one more in me. Yeah. I tried to bully a guy one. I tried my hand, <laughs> I tried my hand at bullying one day. Yeah. This kid. I'm friends with him now to this day, but I... I, I Jim Norton? No. <laughs> you wouldn't have to. He just fucking coax you under a porch. <laughs> Don't beat me up. Just come here for a second. Let me show you Suck something. My dick. <laughs> I uh, I went up to the kid. I was like, "Fuck you! What the fuck are you looking at?" And he was all scared. But then his big friend Bobby Sacchetti came up behind oh, him. And bi I ha I was bitching this kid out, and everybody was surrounding us. And then he came over and bitched me out in front of it. Like just oh, reversed you looked like a dick. He's like, it was what? like watching the little fish. Get eaten uh, by the bigger yes, one, and then and the, the bigger big one. one. Uh, because he, he was like Matt Dillon. This kid looked just like Matt Dillon, and I've always been afraid of Matt Dillon since that movie. <laughs> so it's I like can't my watch the outsiders. Yeah. yeah, it was just bad. Exactly. It's like my bodyguard. I was just scared of him. He walked. He goes, "What are you gonna do, huh?" And I was like, "Nothing." And he was like, "Beat it, you fag." It's oh, Rudy's bike oh, now. Oh, oh. oh, I was fucking Rudy's bike now. Exactly. Oh, oh, oh. yeah, he that, really that's is. bad. So you grew up in New Jersey, where? Yep, mm -hmm. Jersey. That's I know, but it's Jersey. I mean. Right here, North Jersey. Okay, I, is this North Jersey? <laughs> well, you taught him to be fucking talkity like yeah, you, this. Man, the I'm, I'm the one on your North side. Jersey. Definitely not. Out, of North all, Jersey. out of all these people in this fucking room, I got your back, and this yeah. is how you do? North Jersey. <laughs> North Jersey, yes. <laughs> Fuck that. Sam man. just keeps hitting him. <laughs> what is that thing with his mouth that makes me <clears throat> fucking laugh? It is an odd little twitch. Have you always had that? Pretty much. You have sisters? Younger. Yeah, yeah. Do oh, you yeah. protect them? Definitely. Hot? Like, you got pictures? I don't have any pictures with me. No, now. why not? Do you live at home? Damn it. I do. I live at home. I don't got no money. I'm living at home. Do you, what's your bedroom? Do wow, you have any posters man. on the wall? Like the last sewer man? O and A. Hey. <laughs> <laughs> have, you, have you ever had sex at all? Ever? Never. Never? Never. Do you man. want to? You think it'd be At cool? some point, definitely. At some point. Like, definitely. <laughs> wow. When ASAP, right? If I hired you a hooker, would you do something with her? Is that a yet? Yeah, you got him. I don't know if you're falling over or having a David, look. <laughs> no, David, I'm, I'm not trying to be fucked Dave, up. We'll David, you don't have to pay for anything. He's right. going to pay for I everything. I promise yeah. you, I'll pay for a hooker. And it'll be a nice looking hooker. I mean, you, okay, you won't know she's a hooker. There you go. <laughs> oh, shit. Yeah, that's what high, do you think, that's man? high grade. What do you think? I might have to think about it. Yeah, yeah. definitely. You might yeah, have to think about DL, it. DL, make sure you tell him like it's a hook, like this is a hooker, because right. he might think he's doing good for the oh, first time in his life. No, but I don't. I, like I, I just want you. To, you need a. You know what it is. You don't even need a home run. You need a fucking base hit. You need. You mm -hmm. just need to do something to make you feel better. Feel like you're in the game. Yeah, you like, just need you a chick to blow on your yeah. cock. Right. <laughs> yeah, you kind of feel like you're on the outside here. Can you know? can is anybody can is, is some have you ever had a hug? Yeah. They gave you a boner? Like, you ever had that? <laughs> <laughs> and what about that blonde girl? Look at that hot blonde right. in the She's audience. looking at her Blackberry. Come uh, here, baby. Come here. Come, come here. Come here. Come here for a second. Come, come here, gorgeous. Don't be like that. Bring you her can in do here. something for your fellow man. Come yeah. here. Bring her in here. Come here. Come here. She got Uggs on and oh everything. Oh, my goodness. She's pretty oh. nice. She's all right. Make me want to be in the NBA. Look, uh... <laughs> <laughs>
look, look, look. What's your name, sweetheart? Leah. You're very pretty. Thank you. Obviously, David is uh, has had some trial some, some trials in his life, right? Right. I want you to make David give him a nice. Could, hug. Wait a minute. Can we stop for one second? Is right. that your boyfriend, the fucking UFC bald guy? Yeah. Uh, yeah. But maybe we should. Uh -oh. Let's. You know me. he's not even jealous because he ain't even getting up. <laughs> wait a second. Yeah, yeah. Maybe we should get he's that. Your concern, yeah. He's not even concerned at all. Look at he got a windbreaker, old man. <laughs> this will get you. Yeah. Look at <laughs> yeah. Let's get the middle-aged lady in the windbreaker. Let's get her in there. Yeah, get her too. Yeah. Come on, sweetie. It'd be like a threesome. <laughs> oh, okay. Yeah, okay. It'd be like a threesome. Yeah, let's line up the See, girl. See, she'll do it. <laughs> now I want you, David. Get between them. Don't don't Where run. Are you? Where are you going? I, don't oh, run. Jesus. I, there you go. At least that voice go. is sexy. Well, he, right. <laughs> Holy shit. Now, David, now, now, this is, you're halfway there, right? All right, now That's I want you to Falcon sandwich loose. him in a great big hug. <laughs> give David a great big hug. No, I'm not like, like, like no, you're taking a fucking not school a friend, picture. Not a friendly like, give him, kind give of him a little thigh. More of a like, oh. somebody, give him a little thigh. <laughs> Listen, this is not. What happened? David, what? Leah, are you He's not scared? Leah, up. What can I tell Leah, you? Leah, give him Relax. A... Leah. David, He's turn to Leah. The wrong way. David, turn I'm to Leah. Trying, I'm, so I'm trying to be in the middle. I'm trying to be in the middle. Hey, man, the man, turn. man turn. At, at some point, somebody's going to dig it a little more. So you got to go with that. Turn. Definitely. Turn. There now you face, go. Now squeeze oh, him from the back. Goodness. Squeeze oh. him from the back. Get him from the back. No, hold the hug. Hold you the like hug. that? Now you get in. Now you get into it. Slide in. Now mush your tits into his face. There you go. I was talking to David. David. So David. Big guy. I was talking to David. We're good. Oh, what happened? Thank Did you, you stop feeling something? <laughs> no. Dave, how you feel, David? It was okay. It was okay? What was wrong yeah, with it? Yeah, it was okay. What was wrong with it? Nothing. Nothing was wrong with it. Did you like it? You got yeah, a, it was nice. Yeah. Did you have a bone? Okay. Are you all right? Yeah. You're not going to pass out? This is my no, I'm not going to pass out, no. Okay. But it was very pleasant. She's a beautiful blonde woman. You have another beautiful br brunette. Yes, definitely. So, so Listen, you... I'm old enough to be... His mother. Right. Okay. And you could even call her that, mommy. That's always great. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Why have I bought into this shit? I'm not yeah. supposed to be doing this. I know. It's like a therapy session oh, now yeah. for David, the young David. I'm gonna, I'm gonna, now, this is your first. This is your, like the appetizer. I'm going to get you a hooker. Yep. And you're going to take her. Right? I don't care if you play dreidel with her or whatever the fuck you want to do. <laughs> whatever you want. Whatever, whatever land, the tin lands on, do that. <laughs> <laughs> Sexual <Ten>. dreidel. David, <laughs> should we call your dad about this? The hooker thing? No. No. <laughs> <laughs> he wouldn't appreciate that shit. Would your father get mad? He would. Because well, would, they want him with a Jewish girl. Right. Okay. And that's it. I, I, I've never seen a Jewish A Jewish hooker. hooker. It's, it's hard to come that, by that deal. Are they? I would think so. Yeah, mm. you'd have to Craigslist that. Yeah, that's, that's a tough <laughs> one. Fucking <laughs> Craigslist. <laughs> Who's your favorite one. actress? Who do you like? Who do you think is really hot as an actress? I like a lot of... Uh, I know, so it won't be hard to pick, name one. Yeah, pick one. <laughs> pick one. Let's go. Yeah, I like uh, Jennifer Aniston. I like... Oh, oh yeah. All right. Okay, Jennifer Can Aniston. Can you no. get him Jennifer <laughs> Aniston? <laughs> Shit, I'd fuck Jennifer Aniston. <laughs> <laughs> I'm fucking fuck in a music rally. Are you crazy? Yeah, you gotta, you gotta I'll aim. fuck her in front of my family. What are you doing? You know what I'm doing. Get out. <laughs> what, what DL's saying, you gotta aim a little lower right. than that. I know. Yeah. You're you, not in you the same right from the, <laughs> That's some time. Yeah. You said a favorite yeah. actress. What about didn't... Blair from... Uh... <laughs> yeah, the, the fucking Facts of Life. Facts of Life. <laughs> you would you fuck her? Well, Blair was actually the blonde one, wasn't she? Yeah, but she was kind of fat. Yeah. Which one was Blair? No, you... I forget it. What hey. about the fat one? Oh, yeah. she was Jewish. <laughs> was she Jewish? Yeah, no. I don't think so. What she about, was. What about Laverne from Laverne and Shirley? Never get done fucking her. Rip the L off her tit. <laughs> the L. <laughs> oh my God, he's gonna kill somebody, man. Oh yeah, yes. yeah. yeah no. There's no doubt he's coming in. He's, he's gonna kill some. Coming back. You know what? Take him. Now you you seem like a cool young dude. Mm -hmm. In between the times you're beating the shit out of him for no reason. Well, I'm gonna give you the money. You okay. Take him out and hire a hooker. What do you think? A, a, a decent? Not we can't Seven get Seven thousand dollars. <laughs> what? <laughs> what does the bitch do after that? <laughs> she fucking she cries. <laughs> nah. Seven thousand. She, she has to quit the business. What is a, what does a hooker cost here? Shit, I uh, you get yourself I, I can one tell you, it's for two, what? it's two, well, it depends on, you, <laughs> Look at Bobby, it's, well, it's two, it's around 150 for a half hour, 200 for the full hour, but that's, Whoa. but then you're going to have to tip them to actually have intercourse, some of them will just jerk you off, maybe, Joe, you okay, the what about, but then, then we can send them to a massage parlor on 30th between 8th and 7th, best one in New York City, you can take a steam and a shower and they wash your balls, uh, <laughs> you know, you, and uh, they give you a good massage and then they jerk you off at the end, but whatever. Well, how's that sound? 
He knows the whole story. He knows I know, but Jesus I know, but how's this? Why, why don't you send him to a massage parlor? The one, That'd be good. The one okay, yeah. Oh, yeah. Can I? Yeah. Would you like a handy? You want it? You want a little happy ending? That's nice. Yeah, and and, and to rub the tension off from him beating the yeah. shit out of you. Listen, you can <laughs> stick your hand under their bra and rub those little flat Asian boobies, or you can you can you can grab the bum while she's jerking you off. Yeah. And if you get lucky, they'll fucking rub your cornhole. <laughs> <laughs> shit, where is this place? <laughs> Thirty eighth. Yeah. 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 You gotta Fuck get him, closed down. It's up until twelve. <laughs> I, have, I, have the hours. I have a coffee mug hanging in the locker room. <laughs> so, hey, look, I'm gonna give you a couple of hundred dollars, right? Well, uh, okay. okay. Wait a minute. No, no, no. Wait a minute. And you, and you I, someone should go with him. I know he's going. No, yep. fuck him. <laughs> no, no. I'm married. I need to go. <laughs> and can I go to jail for this? Like, yes. Solicitor? No, I don't think so. Yes, okay. you're, no. Actually, right now. Okay. Look, take take two hundred dollars. Oh my god. And then you Damn, go. Look at this guy. No, no, take it, man. Take this fucking money. I don't know if I here. <laughs> you, wait, I'm what? not a dope dealer. What the fuck is this? <laughs> Jesus Christ! I'm not Christ. actually making yeah. you do anything. Listen, Once I touch that money, money, take the money. Take the money. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. This is what you do. Now, this it's is a, you do. Listen, let me explain to you first. Oh, I was good acting by David, by the way. I'm going to take the money. I'm going to tell you, it's $100 at the door. Right. Then you tip them 40 Right. Don't tip them fucking the other hundred. She's just jerking you. Two. No. <laughs> change it. Change, <laughs> dummy. Listen. <laughs> Holy shit. Listen, right. don't give her the other. You give her 40 bucks or maybe 50 if she gave you a nice nut. Right. And no. she re she rubbed the little fucking radio hole. Right. Okay. But don't give him the other 50. If Sam, you know, walk him through that. this. All right. Well, and then you keep the other 50, this. all right? So okay. then, you, then, you, and then you can go I to like get, get a... Get a shot of penicillin. I hope he gets busted in a sting. <laughs> <laughs> Dale just did okay. the math in his head. He's like, fuck, I just wasted 50 bucks. <laughs> now, you're going to do it, right? Yes. You promise? I promise. Uh, I don't know where the place I'm is. 30, right? It's on uh, the 30th? We'll, we'll find between it Between 7th and 8th. Okay. All right, I'm not going to say where because I don't want him to get busted. It's my favorite place. Very clean. The ladies are very nice. They give you, it's a legitimate massage. You can go in the steam room for a while. I think they'll let you wear your windbreaker. No. No. <laughs> but you can't put the hood over your head. <laughs> All right, so you're going, okay. right? Sure, yes. Okay, so yes. happy Hanukkah. It's a Hanukkah a present from me. That's, That's nice. That's what very a, nice of you. Yeah, right. What a great right. Hanukkah. Wow. Yeah. Then, you, then you make sure you... And then you Thank know you. what? And then after you get laid, you come in and you knock the fuck out of him right there. <laughs> yeah. That's right. Deeper voice. He'll and then, sound then, better. And then fuck him in the ass. <laughs> <laughs> No, not, I was just bullshitting about the last two parts of those. Right, I know. But you get, you, and they have a good time, man. Relax. You deserve Damn. it. You're an intern, you, and then go home and um, just go to your room, and when your father asks what's wrong, just say you don't want to talk about it, all right? Just do okay. that. Say, hey, motherfucker. No, no, no. Don't ever try that to get your day. But yeah. you, so you're doing it today, right? Yeah. Yeah, today. Yeah. All right. So After the show, yep. Sam, well, you're Monday, I'm going to call in and yep. see what happens. Are you going to call gonna, in? I'm going to mm -hmm. call in to see what happens. Yeah, you better spend his money. This could be a turning point. Right. Right. You better do it right. You, know you, you might go home tonight and throw that head you have in a box in your closet out and just fucking start a whole new life. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, man. And, and, and you don't have to wear the part on the side like that. Just to, to give that up. <laughs> yeah, yeah. The windbreaker yeah. and the part on the Can side. Can we change that right now? Yeah, move it around. Just, like, mess up your hair. Yeah, right. Yeah. Go it doesn't look. It's Sam, still, get it's a still little apart. water. Put a little water. Yeah. Okay. yeah, yeah you, you, you look you like the walk. nerd in Greece. Oh, oh God, now, what damn. Was his name? That guy, yeah. What was that guy's name? <laughs> I don't know, but I know who you're talking about. Okay, throw the pie. Oh, no, I'm fine. Hey, uh, that so part's been there since hair. like you, you, you know I, eight. Just, help him with his hair. <laughs> Actually, no. There you go. There, see. Yeah, yeah, yeah help see. him. With, yeah, she's there, a hair. Oh, look at that. There you go. There you go. Nice. Look at what changing, oh, David. There was only a little gel. There is gel in it. Oh, okay. no, but she's got gel. A little water. <laughs> oh, bro, bro. Now, see. Oh, now, see. Now, see. Oh, now, see. Oh, now, see. Oh, David, back to people right making. There, hey, David. Oh. David. David. You give me that 200, I'll beat the fuck out of Sam right now. <laughs> Motherfucker, what are you doing to me? What are Motherfucker. You, what did he do to you? We're just poured, styling hair. He poured like a whole bottle of water on my head. All right, David, I'll take 50. I'll smack Sam right in the face for you right now. Yeah, give me 50. We'll and I'll fuck him in the ass. Okay. I mean, no. For your, for your pleasure. So, 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 you know what? It, you can you can suffer all these insults, but just know in in, 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 in the thirty minutes you're gonna be getting the rub down of your life. Right. You're gonna have a good time. So you got something to look forward to. So it's thirtieth between eighth and oh seventh and eighth. Yeah, stop repeating it. The fuck, just call the cops on yourself. <laughs> Jesus Christ, <laughs> David. I'll tell you off the air exactly where it is. All right, gotcha. Ask for Camille. 
Because it's an Asian I'm fucking around. Yeah. 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 This could be the biggest massage parlor listen. plus in New York City history. Right. <laughs> listen to me. Hey, listen to me. You this, go in. This is a recipe nice. for disaster. Oh, my goodness. It's very nice. Okay. Well, you don't have to worry about oh. getting AIDS. <laughs> so it's just, it, it, you, it's very clean. You know, you, did you better be. They give you a real massage. Yeah. And don't then, you worry. Who's, no. getting, who's bringing them down there? Just make sure you don't, you know. But David, at the yeah. end. Well, well David, David, what, what, if you I, can I get into it, but you should have enough for a taxi, right? Oh, yeah. He has enough for a taxi and a sandwich. You get a taxi, a sandwich, and a nice This is the whole thing. David, Batteries included. This right. is, you yeah. David, included everything. at yes. the end, when she turns you over and, she, and you have a hard on, hopefully, <laughs> right? And she's like, oh, you're stressful here. Don't go, no, I'm not. It's my back. Right. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Why would I do that? I'm just, I'm just making sure. Which yeah, because they might not ask you. Like, they're not going to be they, specific. Yeah, they don't really. They give you a back rub, and they make it, like, legit. Right. And then they roll you over. But they might tickle your asshole a little bit, like, graze your nut with a fingernail and tickle it a little bit. And then they roll you over, and they like they giggle, like, oh, oh look at this. <laughs> you look like that. You look like Do they really disgusting. giggle? Like oh, you? They always giggle. When they see the hard cock, I'd be like, fucking oh. so mad. Mad. Like, stop giggling. Oh, I love <laughs> it. Giggling ass. Yeah. Oh, they, so much let me tell you, they story. stop giggling mm. when they have to clean up your hot load. <laughs> <laughs> My dead babies are stuck between their knuckles and their wedding ring. <laughs> This is fucking uh, horrible, man. Uh, you got a point there, Bob. Right. <laughs> you might might as well chuckle at your dick. And you know why he knows? Because he's, he's, uh, he's well, man, lived I wonder, life. Oh, yeah. so much about this. Place. He's lived life. Listen, dude. Yeah. That's the that's the that's the that's what. Do you what do you look forward to every day? I look forward to just parting your hair yeah. to the side. Definitely, man. <laughs> just look forward to just being alive and having being grateful for living. Look how much yeah, better your hair looks like, already. You gotta live, though, man. Yeah. Like, yeah you gotta eat, yeah. drink. The, the, the women are the best thing ever, You're man. existing. Look at You're that. not, yeah, like, living. Yeah, women are the that. best thing Does ever. Does that feel good when she Can touches your you. hair? And Eddie, yeah, feels good. Eddie Deason. Really? Yeah. Yeah. yeah, that's, 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 that, 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 see, that's very cool. Keep your hair like that, cool. dude. Yeah, now you're looking okay. a little more... You look uh, younger. Look at that. Right. It's spiked out a little bit. Right. Nice. You, less, you look less B&H photo. <laughs> Would you like a Calzio lens with that, sir? That's <laughs> a great place. This place is great, oh, isn't it? And hey, man, this, I hope this is the runway. It learned efficiency from off, somewhere. Man. Just have a fucking good time. Eat, drink, and, get a and, nice chip. And if you don't do this, you're going to have to answer to him. Right, Screw man. answering to Sam. You're going right. to have to answer to the I man. Bet, I, I, I bet you right now he goes and invests this money, and <laughs> fucking 10 years, he's a multi-millionaire. <laughs> <laughs> he fucking owns CBS. <laughs> and Let me tell you about the day D.O. Ugly <laughs> made me a millionaire. Oh, I oh yeah, I shot my load all right. I took it to him. <laughs> I could have jerked off into my own stomach, but I didn't. I Let shot it. my load into pharmaceuticals. <laughs> yeah, <I did>. <laughs> yes, <laughs> yes, yes. <laughs> He's probably the super oh, millionaire from this, that show you were talking about earlier. Oh, this yellow him, jacket was the same jacket I wore that day. David. You might have to wear that yellow jacket with all the sperm you got in you. Oh, yeah. Yeah. It's like I a know. brain slicker. Oh, my goodness. <laughs> Fucking A, right? So you're going to do this uh, like now? Uh, when the show ends, yeah. Well, the show's uh, ended. It's, yeah. it's over yeah, for then, you. I mean, go then, right now. Yeah, take a hike. Go. You're in a tough spot. Take him, man. Take go him. Go now him. and call. Take him. Call. Let's go. go He's taking. Go right now. Yes, yeah. right now. And Here don't wince when she touches. Like every. <laughs> Yeah, don't, don't don't wince. Don't wince when she yeah. don't do that creepy lip shit when she's jerking right, you off. Right. Oh my god. All right. So she's gonna on. run out of that place like that little Asian then, girl that right. has napalm on happy, her. Happy happy on man. Man. He's gonna, Thank he's you gonna, so much, Dio. You go have a good time. Come look like no, a straight that, that's that's the hand you use, right? cock. Come on, hug my neck, man. Thank All right, there's oh, a bro oh, hug. There's a bro oh, hug. Yeah. David, 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 David. David, Now you start to walk See, out. See, you start to walk out. You get the, David, you get the David. slow clap. Oh, man. Come on, give him a pull. There we there go. go. There goes. You know what, man? Turn, David. Just when you think life is fucked up for you. Yeah, you yeah. got something like that. You get something like that. And yeah, and realize, wow, wow. it could have been me. Bad, there, right. but for the grace of God, right. and, and you know, I'm a Catholic. parenting and let me good friends and yes. everything else go I personality. I mean, I mean, yeah. just <laughs> it, it was one experience because you know everybody wishes they could take back five minutes of their life. Five yeah. minutes. Yeah, one experience, man. Could you could have been that? I could have been that. You never know. I wish it was you the last know. five. <laughs> <laughs> Sam, That's horrible. I know what molds you into who you are. Right. Or who you oh, aren't. Yeah, I don't know. We got to get Sam to do a what's the haps. Like, you know, tape this whole thing. Oh, yeah. Not, right. not in. 
Sam, you gotta do kind of like a what's the haps? We're outside this place. David's going inside. You know that type okay. of thing. All right. We gotta get some audio for Monday. Uh, David's happy ending is brought to you by WebEx.com. Hold meetings, make presentations, <laughs> do it from the comfort of your own home or office. Check it out at WebEx.com. WebEx. 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 Very cool. Fuck DL, man. Oh man. DL, always, always a pleasure to have Likewise, you. Likewise, man. man. You guys are, man. I Very don't, cool. I don't know why I never get invited here. I know you can only have one black guy at a time. <laughs> yeah, that's what it is. So, it's so a rule. Well, Patrice is club rules, you know. <laughs> it's an open door for you, man. But when Patrice is gone. I'll slide in. You <laughs> yeah. know, you're on the, you're on the West Coast. That's the problem. No, right? I'm here. You're now here full time. I live in Tribeca. Do our show more often. Yeah, yeah, I live in Tribeca. You want, man? Every time we tell you it's an open door policy. Well, you know, people say that. Like we Trump mean it. No, we by, mean it. And then you we do it like, it. who's the fuck is this? Yeah, who the fuck is this? Send you show up away. and they look right. at you weird. Right. So then, you know. But I, I do. I, well, I, I, I moved to New York now. It's, it's, a, it's a different kind of experience for me. I'm lonely here. <laughs> we won't. Any any time we'll have Steve then fucking call and and say yeah, you know, man I'd love to come on down and just fucking wallet, hang. why did you just hand your two hundred dollars to intern David yeah, yeah, why don't you go man. with him right yeah you know it's a I'm nice, trying to, I'm trying a to nice gesture man kind of, that made me feel literally I felt horrible for him really yeah oh, yeah. yeah I felt bad for him it's oh, just, just like the, you the third I, grade I type shit yeah it was it's that right, third grade shit brutal Bobby brought up a point earlier where he said yeah I tried to be a bully once in school and stuff like I tried to get there was a a crowd of like bullies and I wanted to kind of be in with them and they were really fucking with this kid so bad and I just was like I can't do this right. I felt like awful doing it yeah. they were punching this kid in the stomach just to see the funny face he I made when, when they did it no. and and then it's like yeah go ahead do it was it. the same thing yeah. that's exactly I, I actually, actually did the face he made I did it I, later in life when I became a punk punk when I was hanging out with those older kids yeah. I was associated with these douchebags and I did some I stole a kid's moped once and Took a CD player once. I actually, this is what I got my shit together. <laughs> stopped drinking, stopped drugging. You know the whole deal. Right. I went to college, worked my way out of fucking really bad classrooms. The shit rubber rooms okay. in the basement. It's still a piece of shit. Went to college, get to English class. I feel like I finally did something with my life. That motherfucker I used to pick on, the the guy took his moped and his. He's in my class. Uh, and I was like, uh, hey, I'm Robert. And he goes, I know who the fuck you are. Oh, oh shit. shit. And I was yes, like, Ooh, see? He never forgot. I still could have kicked yeah. his ass so he didn't fuck with me. But oh, okay. <laughs> I should have shook him. Yeah, man. I mean, yeah, just, that I got, stuff sticks with you. Yeah, it made me feel like shit. Yeah. And, and the, the the thing I feel the worst about, like, when you're growing up, you do shit because you want people to think you cool. Yeah. Yeah. But the coolest shit is to do the shit you want to do. Yeah. 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 Like, that's the coolest shit to go, ah, fuck, that ain't cool to me. I, I, I told this story, like, a while ago. That I was uh, in the hallway school, and there was this girl she wasn't cute but she wasn't ugly or anything like that and so you beat her and raped her yeah so i just <laughs> fucked her in the asshole Jesus. she she was at a, she was at her locker and god damn bobby some shit like so is bobby. i thought norton was bad but you literally bobby is just oh, the worst horrible, I, you know what i take it too far i apologize I, oh norton, my god. norton knows how to finesse it in and make it you know yeah yeah, yeah it's yeah, over yeah. the when top you, bob yeah, right i'm, so, I'm like, sorry oh, over okay the top so what happened bob. you were fucking her in yeah, no, no no i'm fucking some her screaming no she had she, she had her head in the locker and she was doing something and and these guys came by and kicked her locker and it smacked her in the fucking head. Oh my god. And she starts crying. She's there crying. I'm like three lockers over. She's crying on the floor. And then you went over and pissed on her face. No, sorry. Like fucking I'm Bobby. Sorry. <laughs> wow. And, and and you know something? I wanted to go over there and console her a little bit What'd and say, and call those guys assholes and shit like that. I didn't do anything. I just stood there, kind of looked at her. Yeah. I looked at the guys who really? were laughing and shit. And I'm just like, and it's it's one of those moments that sticks with me because it's like you could have just kind of gone over and go, hey, are you okay? Don't mind those fucking assholes or something like that. And not even as a ploy to get laid or anything, right. just to be like kind the of human. a decent human just being. Human. Yeah. Uh, and when you see someone really get fucked over like that for no reason, and I just fucking stood there and did nothing because I knew those guys would have gotten on my shit. If I would have gone over there, so that you just when don't I was do a it. kid, though, no, no but I, I, some things you like, I would see just people do the most brutal shit, like growing mm -hmm. up. Like I grew up on 135th and Avalon. One time I was a kid, I was 13 years old. Four, I could have been 12. And these dudes like, we got this girl, and she wants us to do a training. I'm like, no, oh, she shit. doesn't. <laughs> get so, out I of go, here, right? so I go, right, and this girl is screaming and crying. And I'm like, this is this girl is scared to fucking death. That's cool. Thanks for bringing dudes, me to a fucking rape. Right. <laughs> these are the old dudes in the neighborhood. So I'm like, hey, man, this is not, like, tw and 12 years old, like, these dudes. I'm like, this is not whatever the words are. We're cool or whatever. Yeah. 
Yeah. So I said no, and, and I take her home, and this girl is crying so bad that her brother runs out the house thinking that I did something to oh, her, shit. and she's so fucking emotional she can't talk, and he's chasing me around a car with a butcher knife. I'm like, Holy he's shit! Like, no, I'm the good guy. Like, I, like, and then she finally gets out. Like he ca- is close to catching me. I could like literally feel him. Like you know, I, I already feel the knife fucking going in. <laughs> and she goes, No, no, it wasn't him. It wasn't him. It wasn't him. And then he says, well, you're going to take me to the motherfuckers that did it. And I'm like, man, I got to live oh, with these shit, dudes. So you yeah. might as well cut me. Now, I can't. Like, like 12 years old, I'm going to go tell these. I yeah, already yeah. stopped them from doing something. And I then brought I, her here. That's my, my that's decency quota for the fucking oh, day. Oh, man. He, he literally tried to make me. I said, well, nah, and, and, and I was trying to. At 12 years old, you really don't know what to say. So I'm like, uh just cut me, man, because I can't. I can't <laughs> go. I, I can't go. I literally cut said, me. "Just cut me," because I can't go back to these Makes dudes. Makes my pussy ass white bread <laughs> locker story look and like t- shit. <laughs> I got, I got, I got and nine. tell them, man, what did I? What am I like? I'm gonna tell on these dudes, this and I gotta get, deliver. This yeah. kid's gonna take a fucking knife, a for knife for for him. some code that doesn't exist. No, no, yeah. not even a code. I, it wasn't even a code. Some it was just that I couldn't. I couldn't live with these dudes and tell no, them. No. Tell a dude from my neighborhood, uh, tell another dude from another neighborhood on the yeah, dudes yeah. in my neighborhood, They'd tell have on them. Fucked you up. Yeah, but see, dude, that's a fuck. I'm, I'm talking about not even tell them so that he can go to jail, but tell them they would have, he would have done something to them. Yeah. Then they would have said, you, man, I gotta live there? Oh, no. Yeah. I was yeah. like, man, you might as well cut me. I don't, I didn't know. Wow. I didn't know. Him. But did he ever, was like, did he ever find out? He went like this. Okay, funk. No, and I, just and I thought him. he was. I like it was. It was a choice. I said either I'm going. Somebody's going to do it, so I might as well do it here. And he didn't. He was so mad. I was like, man, that's the last time I get involved in this shit again. Yeah, right. <laughs> last time I stop a rape. I'm just gonna let it happen next time. Right. Like, I get involved in rape. Right. It's ears depressing me. <laughs> like Charlie Sheen after they went in that village. Fuck <laughs> it off! They're human pudding being with you. Oh my god. Uh, police up your dicks. <laughs> <laughs> that's that's so when I see a guy like David, uh, man, he just uh, That's yeah. just horrible that he just like, how do you live like that? How are you so passive like that? He's a fucking gazelle waiting to just get ripped apart at the lion in New York. watering hole. No <laughs> we, got Sam <laughs> you know? in, we got Sam back in here. How's David handling everything that went down? Well, he's kind of processing everything. He keeps asking me, am I really going? Yes. Are you, are you going with me? Am I going by myself? Are you sure you have time? Dude, oh, yeah. you gotta oh. just take him. Yeah, I know. You gotta just jump in a cab yeah. right now before it wears off. Yeah, yeah. Go bring him down there. right now. Tape okay. uh, tape the ride in a cab. You yep. need cab money? No, he's got fifty yeah, dollars. We got oh, yeah. to get more yeah. the cab and quick stuff. before he buys a treasury yeah. bond. <laughs> <laughs> Some shit. I, I bought gold. <laughs> I bought gold. My name is Goldberg. That's a good investment. Danny Goldberg. <laughs> Do a little interviewing in What's the cab. Name? Okay. Let's see. A little uh, interview as you as you point out the location. And then send him on his way, and then uh, it Wait, shouldn't take more than what? We'll this is great. What, what, if, what if Sam and Dave were really lovers, and they just took this money, went to a restaurant, <laughs> and fucked each other in the y- park? You Why certainly have that? bizarre fantasies there, I'm Robert. I'm just fucking just thinking. It's a radio show. I'm trying to add. Robert, is there a, <laughs> is there a code? Is is David going to like blow up his spot when he goes in there? Yeah, the code is finger fuck my asshole while I, you jerk me off. <laughs> Put two knuckles in. <laughs> Subtle. That is should he say yeah, that? Go past your ring finger. Bobby, Bobby, should he say that he heard about this place from a national talk show? <laughs> no, no, no. Well, the, the thing that I always, I always have to convince him that I'm not an undercover cop. Because I look like every fucking shithead yeah. on NYPD yeah. Blue. Kind of. Nar kind of. But these yeah. two, if these two walk in, they'd be like, come yeah. in, faggots. <laughs> <laughs> I'll probably be waiting for David outside of the establishment. No, they have a wait. They have a yeah. Don't go if you're not going to do it. Yeah, yeah. There's yeah. a waiting room. Some guy would walk in and point at you. I want. <laughs> I want him. <laughs> and, uh, you see Sam in a white smock. <laughs> right. <laughs> Sam, are you devil joining? Can you keep a secret? <laughs> I need those things. This is a. This is. A, I just want you to know that I feel horrible right now. Why? Wow, you should feel good. You're yeah, fucking you fucking you did Nick. a good thing. Oh, you want your money back? Well, no, no, no. That, 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 that. I just want him to have a good time. He'll have, hey, a good time. he'll have a good time. Bring him we'll down. Get him some cotton candy on the left yeah, side. That always makes yeah. Great time. And after you're done, take him in the sauna and let him do the spa. Let him relax a little. Get his schwitz. And wait a minute. He has to wait. He has to get the table shower. Okay. They wash you. <laughs> so should you ask for a table shower? No. Yes. Go look. You 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 go in. He gets a locker. Takes his clothes off. Gets in a robe or a towel. Gets in a towel. Then he puts all his stuff in. Takes his key. Go in. Say, I want a table shower. This 
Really He's hot. never going to remember all this. He'll no. remember table show. It's it's crazy. Gonna, Spanish girl's going to wash him down on a fucking wet bed, okay. scrub his asshole, his balls. He's going to get a hard on. <laughs> he might even blow his nut right there. <laughs> that almost happens. Then they dry you off, put a robe on you, flip flops, and then they whisk you out the door where an Asian lady will take you and do that little Asian Japanese tiptoe walk all the way to a room. Okay. And uh, then they give you a massage. So right. table, sh take your clothes off, locker, table shower. And then they they'll send you on the way. That's so, fantastic. It's like Domino's. Is after he gonna that. have enough money for all this, dude? That's only 140 bucks. It's for the everything. Everything. For everything. Yeah, everything. Bucks. And yeah. the table shower. You can get a cheaper one on uh, Fifth Ave, but that's my place. I don't want to blow that spot up. Because yeah. <laughs> that girl immediately just puts you on all fours and starts tickling your asshole <laughs> and jerking you off backwards. <laughs> I'm not, oh, I'm, there's no way I'm blowing that spot up. Really? Yeah, and she's kind of hot, so. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, you guys are laughing. I'm going. Where is this? Yeah, I know, right? I'll Bobby, you, I'll doesn't Bobby you know make a, a fucking whorehouse sound <laughs> right. charming? Oh, like, God, you it sounds charming. Oh, God, they, I love that place. They should let you sell Chrysler. Oh, yeah, you're, you're whisked away. He says it's a fucking hand job oh, joint. I was, I was confused by uh, how you were describing the first place. I'm like, why is he telling everyone where this spot is? Right. I, I knew yeah. you had something. Oh, in I your got head. my secret spots that right, I don't. So fucking you're not tell giving out the secret spot. No. No, no, not at all. That's the one. Okay. <laughs> yeah. The that's table a, shower is the one he's going to. Yeah. I mean, they have a table shower at my one, but, you know, and that one's, the one I go to is way better because they, they spend like 20 minutes on the table shower. Really? Oh, yeah. They wash yeah. everything. Goodness and gracious. I mean everything. Goodness gracious. Oh, fantastic. Yeah. This well, one's very professional. What else do they wash? Really? What else are they washing that thing? Oh, supposed everything. To be? Everything. Yeah. Oh, it's gorgeous. It's right, fucking well, gorgeous. This one's really comfortable. They play that thong -thong 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 -thong, that music while you're getting... I'm sure he'll enjoy it. Yeah. It's good. Yeah, what's yeah. The, what, what music do they play? Uh, thong -thong 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 -thong. <laughs> yeah, I was kind of... When he did that, I was like, <laughs> what? A banjo? It's, it's, or? That, it's that three fucking string guitar. <laughs> bong, 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 that kill Bill shit. Chinese banjo. <laughs> this sounds fantastic, man. Right, like Sam. half the theme from Deliverance. <laughs> what the fuck sounds like? All right, Sam, you're busy. Go get yeah, David. Yeah, we're going to cab. Go to we got to get the fuck out of here, too. You yeah, should actually go. just jerk him off in the cab and take the 200. Just kick him out of the cab. So long, stupid. <laughs> right. Uh, what is wrong with you, man? Uh, oh, we this, learned what's wrong with him today. This motherfucker here. Yeah. Anytime you can make Jim Norton seem like a nice guy. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Uh, like, God yeah. damn. Now, <laughs> Kelly's got some problems, too. Yeah. Well, really, I mean, come on. I don't have to. No, I'm like, so similar. Right, no, just, I don't, have to, I don't have to put trash bags on my fucking bathroom floor. Let's just put it that way. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> When you're at that point, yeah, and then and the one who's doing it is a buddy of yours. <laughs> when you're both oh. calling each other fella, <laughs> good job. Oh. No, I'm joking. Goodness gracious! Uh, so this is you guys just watching it. I like this girl on uh, MSNBC. Today. Which one? Oh, which one's Pretty that? Black uh, girl. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. She's a, she's the short hair. Oh man, she's no. She's in New York, huh? Which girl? The girl who's covering the story. Yeah, she's yeah but really... how's that going to work out? You're on scene. Oh, they man. found her body. It's fucking great. Kaylee's yeah. body found. They're not... It's looking like it, but they're not... What a fucking shit. What do you think? Job. She ran right. off to fucking become a longshoreman? <laughs> <laughs> of course they did. She was dead. So. Look at... She's a psycho. You can tell. No yeah. shit. Look at that mm -hmm. fake smile. Mm -hmm. I'm going to kill this fucking kid. Mm -mm. Ooh, uh, she's kind of hot, dude. She's a... This girl. Yeah, right? like... Oh, oh they yeah. switched yeah. back. Oh, oh, look at that. Amy Robach. Is that that's no? I'm talking about the uh, not I the didn't white. Think no, you were the talking about oh, what the fuck is going on with her? Right. She's <laughs> taking. <laughs> sure. She's Trump. sitting on a plunger. Does anyone know they're on camera? <laughs> right. What the hell is going on? She's sitting on a plunger. Oh, look at that! Funny. They're all showing a little nice. leg, boots. Look at that one. Man, that's pretty stockings. nice. Yeah. That's pretty nice. I got it. Going on. Jamie's all right. They're really trying to get ratings. What happened? David's leaving officially. Oh, David's uh, right, David. walking all out right. the door. Everybody's giving him a fond farewell. He's gonna come back a new man. I don't it's like know. fucking Porky's Five. You know, <laughs> <laughs> terrible. You know this is gonna be a disaster. Something of bad. Course this is gonna be a disaster. Yeah, this can't you work call out. 911 no. right now, as like a, a father, and go, "My son is it?" And we need to get this place fucking ratted out. This is absolutely not gonna work out. It's not no, something man. will fuck up. I'll tell you what's gonna happen. What e Rock? Uh, e Rock's, Rock's coming in smiling. So either he just had a big hero sandwich, <laughs> or <laughs> something happened. Maybe both. Oh. Um, um, no, Sam's trying to get him out of the office. He's like, come on, let's go, let's go. 
David says, you're going to leave me there. Sam's, no, I'll, I'll wait. This till isn't a ditching yeah, of somebody. Right. We're not, like a, hold on, even if he does, he's yeah, got 200 is, in his pocket. Right. Yeah, yeah. Right. Yeah. Right. 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 It's so, only like 20 or so blocks from here. What is he talking about? So Sam says, no, I'll, I'll wait till you're done, but I'm not going in. And, Sa and David just goes, but what if it takes like an hour or more? <laughs> uh, slow down there, champ. Yeah. Yeah, an you hour. Know, yeah, first time out. Or <laughs> what? Yeah. 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 Who the fuck are you, Sting? He's going <laughs> to <Yeah. laughs> tantric hour. shit. <laughs> he's going to put a towel over his pocket. He's going to blow his load. He's going to put a towel over the pocket. It's going to be fucking come on the hundred. <laughs> he pulls it out of his pocket. <laughs> that motherfucker is done in three wow. seconds. <laughs> oh, my goodness. You remember the first time a girl touched your fucking yeah. dick? Forget yeah. about it. Ridiculous. That was yeah. like, it, it, the first thing that goes through your mind is why does this feel so much different and better than when I touch it right. myself? Does it right. have to be a girl, my and, memory? Oh, shit. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I should have known. I'm sorry. You should include people like you. <laughs> Could it be that guy who promised me a steak? Or the uncle. <laughs> the uncle that helped you make bow and arrows. <laughs> All the stories that you fucking told over the years. Now remember, kids, you don't want Uncle Sam to kill you. <laughs> yeah. You could keep a secret, Robert. Right. <laughs> yeah. well, 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 what do we always say? Don't tell her. We'll kill your parents. <laughs> really? oh, that's spectacular. Uh, <laughs> Uncle Wallace, creepy you're uncle wonderful. that gives you gives you a puppy for Christmas <laughs> so he can make like he's gonna strangle it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Hey, uh, Lily, Christmas. you uh, you're not gonna be working for Ron and Fez today. We have a special assignment for you. So, oh, no. Ron and Fez will understand. We need you, we need you to sneak yeah. into a massage parlor and jerk <laughs> David off. <laughs> Speaking of which, those guys are in a cab. Let's check in with them for a second. Lily, stay right there. Sam. Yeah. All right, we got Sam in a cab, DL, so this might be uh, happening. So what, what's going yeah. on, Sam? We're in a cab right now. This is definitely happening. Really? All right. Is he motivated now? Yeah, he's ready to do this. Okay, are you guys getting close? Uh, no, we, we, it took us a minute to get a cab. So we're still a little miles away. You know, they just don't pick Jews up, those cabs. <laughs> I hate them. Uh, that uh, another uh, that proves that you might be black there, Sam. It's how far? Yeah, how far? Yeah, the hair. <laughs> the hair did it. Try to wear a hat next yeah. time. Yeah. Try to, <laughs> right. Well, it's all Pakistanis. They think we're gonna pick David up. <laughs> <laughs> Good point. Uh, what What has David been saying in the cab, Sam? Anything? He, he, keep, he said, uh, "Are we really gonna go? Are we really gonna go?" And I said, "Yes, we're going now. Yes, we are going." How far are you guys away? Uh, we just got in a cab right before I called you. Okay. He's acting like a child going to Six Flags. Oh, this no. kind of, this it's is like a, this He's is, so excited. This is Six yeah. Flags, man. Are we really going? Are we really doing right. this? That'd be funny if they actually did switch over to legit, and he's down there, like, <laughs> and they, you know, he's just like, no, 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 jerk me off. I, <laughs> you got to jerk my, my cock. <laughs> then he starts going, motherfucker, jerk my cock off. <laughs> yeah, he lost the DL. Yeah. Laying down some DL on his fucking yeah, yeah. Just yeah. take him out yeah, arrested. Yeah, testifying. <laughs> Your Honor, when I said you know, that, I didn't I really mean it. Oh, uh, did you shit. supply the funding for this? Uh, <laughs> right. Oh, no, I mean, yeah, yeah, shit. Some I mean, kind of way I get it. Yeah, yeah, you're fucked somehow. Right, right, right. Somehow DL's in fucking Just to let everybody know. Would you write I me, really give him the no, no Would you write me? I would not write him. You wouldn't write me? What does that mean? No. I mean, it's like if, if it turns bad and David is, and I'm indicted behind some sexual scandal with David. Write him if he's oh, in jail. I like jail. him much better than I like intern David. Oh, oh shit. Oh, but you, would, you write him in, would you write him in jail? Right. Would you come see me? Like, ride? Oh, I think. No, no right. right. Oh, well, they, 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 they have a problem with their <laughs> R's. Oh, on <laughs> All have a problem with their R's. Yeah. <laughs> Fuck is wrong. <laughs> <laughs> hey, we gotta know. give uh, More stereotyping. <laughs> we gotta give Ron and Fez one of our guys because Lily's not working today. This is hysterical. Who, who can work for uh, Ron and Fez today? Because Lily's. Uh... What do you do for them? I. Uh, thank you, Rock. Huh? So you say nothing? I intern for them, so that means oh. everything. From she does a lot of on air, too. She's, were, she's on air a lot. How come they're fucking. Ron and Fez just are really. Come, when it comes to picking interns, Dude. are fucking unbelievable. Lily, now her, and you got a 38 year old me. You You're right. 38, 38 year old <laughs> guy and a, and a yeah, Jewish and Ron intern. Ron and Fez that's never have a way house. of, get, like, they endear themselves to their audience, to the interns, to yeah. this. And even though the fact that, I'll, I'll be honest, Ronnie doesn't seem like the easiest guy to uh, deal with. Really? On a certain basis. It's actually Ron times. Bennington that attracted me to the Ron Fest show. Of course, Ronnie's a genius. I love yeah. Ronnie. He's very sexy. But yeah. Ronnie, but if you're As a well. guy walking around, Ronnie will give you shit if you're fucking That's up. That's right. That's true. So, but but, but he, he uses that control with compassion. 
unlike some other people. Well, what are you going to do? <laughs> yeah. What are you going to do? Oh, Opie uh, is like Stalin. Yeah, what are you going to do? It's, it's worked for us for a while. Could you right. imagine her hey. here every fucking day? We, that's why we don't have female interns. We why? Don't, we don't want to be distracted. We'd be fucking them. <laughs> <laughs> Whether they like it or not. Today is rape the intern day. <laughs> Yay! Uh, Jimmy wins again. <laughs> Lily, by the way, Ron and Fez noon to three. Oh, shit. Yeah, Ron yeah. and Fez noon to That's three. Oh, yeah, damn. You late. forgot to give the plug, Ben. I don't like that. Sam. You know, aren't they on the air in like yeah, six minutes? Yeah. Six minutes? Yeah. Ah, whatever. Sam. Um, whatever. Yeah. We're what do you so uh all Bonus right any show. any final thoughts there? We're going down Ninth Avenue. This is gonna be the experience of a lifetime for all of us. And you're uh taping some audio? Yeah, we're gonna have audio. All right, we'll have that on Monday. Yeah. yeah. I'm Ooh, what I, a got, nice I gotta tease. call and see how this works. Oh yeah, of absolutely. Because, call uh, you live in New York, you come back in I, on Monday. I, uh, I I I gotta be in uh LA. <laughs> You, you, what a humanitarian, though, that was. Hey, that man, was a great move. Did. That's probably uh, the coolest you know, thing ever. That you saw that like Johnny Appleseed. You know. Guy was in need. Yeah. Johnny. We got Sam in studio. Uh, Friday show. I was the only one here Friday. Every day it's a different lineup with the radio show. You was what? I was the only one here. Jimmy was gone. You weren't here. I'm just saying. No one so called I, me, I, but I, Anthony <laughs> was here, right? Yeah, but he's not here now. I'm talking about the people in the room. So I'm going to explain what happened on Friday show. Holy mother. God. It, the, the sh the lineup of the Opie and Anthony show Friday was myself, Anthony, Bob Kelly, mm -hmm. D. L. Hughley. Okay. We did a little something with intern David, and D. L. Hughley felt so bad for the kid. He goes, he well, he said, here, you need to get laid. Yeah. I'm trying to like uh, not blow up anyone's spot, so we got to kind of be careful with uh, how it went down Friday. The regular listeners know, but we got an update. Yeah. Uh, Bob Kelly was bragging about a uh, Yankee Cranky shop, Jimmy, that okay. he loves. He loves. He went into graphic detail about why he loves this place and blah, blah, blah. Then it turns out that he, he likes another cranky, uh, Yankee Cranky shop even better, but he didn't want to mention that one because he doesn't want to blow up that spot. Right. He was willing to t talk about this one place just in case it does get busted. He's got another place that he likes even better. Got it? So... Uh, we, we sent David down to uh, a Yankee Cranky shop, for real. And, and David went through with this. Yes, 100%. We got in the cab, and he went through with it. He asked a bunch of questions and everything, but he was completely ready, willing, and able. And there's nothing wrong. We call them Yankee Cranky shops, but technically what they really are is massage places. And there's nothing wrong with sending a guy to get a, a legal massage. It's right. like there are times where you know you, the girls might do things they might not, but you're not really privy to that beforehand. Um, but make no mistake about it, it's a real massage place <laughs> yeah. where people get massages. Occasionally, the girls might do shit. I, I don't know. Right. There you go. And we had a whole discussion about that on Friday. So we, uh, we sent Sam down with David to go to this uh, massage parlor there, Jimmy. Okay. And we got some audio. Uh, you taped the, the ride and everything. Yeah, I got a, as much as I could. I ended up with like an hour and 15 minutes of audio to go through with this kid. Right. But, uh, but yeah, we started... Uh, in the cab, or right when we got out of the cab, and he was he was excited at this point because we were in front of the place. Right. We had taken the cab over, and he knew he was really going to do it. And uh, yeah, that's where the audio starts. All right. I think the penthouse magazines are distracting everyone today. Yeah, big pussy books. <laughs> and, and it's not like we have one. We have about ten copies. One, two, three, four, five, six. We lost we lost Patrice. Seven. No, 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 no. Eight. No, no. There's one over there. We got eight copies of this no, magazine. No, no, we didn't lose Patrice. Right, I'm good. just looking through. That's all. But I'm listening. I'm watching. Oh, by man. the way, uh, who was telling the Patrice story on Friday? Was it uh, Bob Kelly? What story? Oh. The, the Amsterdam story? Because I wanted to get you on the phone to talk about this. Oh, I got that later, but I don't know what story he told. Who was it? Was I, it Bob fell Kelly? In, I fell in love. Yeah. In, oh, in Bob Amsterdam. Kelly said that... Oh, I remember that. I wasn't even there. I remember that. You were uh, checking out the girls in the windows in mm -hmm. Amsterdam, and you were going in, but you weren't, uh, you weren't popping your nut. You wanted to save it. So you would do a little something here, then you move on to the next one and do a little something here. <laughs> yeah, man. Then a little man. Something. Okay. And then Bobby goes, when you finally decided to, you know, you know, let the nut go, the woman afterwards showed back up in the window with, like, just, she looked like she's been through a war or something, and she turned her sign around that said, closed. Because... <laughs> <laughs> 
I don't know. My self esteem just uh I just want you wrecked, I, I really want to, you to wrecked feel this liked one. when I when I had when when I did that shit. Yeah. I just wanted to be liked. Yeah. So I would go in and if I didn't what I was looking for before I knew the phrase was a GFE. I was looking for that. We learned that's then, that girlfriend experience. I, yes, yes. And then I found um that in that particular girl. She yeah. was a soldier. And and we just and, we had a good time. That is that's ten years ago. And you well and yeah, she had to put her sign that she was closed <laughs> for the day after you were done with her. But see the the, the thing about Amsterdam, dude. I, I don't. I tell you, I, I fell in love with an eighteen year old girl in Amsterdam. It was unbelievable. And I fell in love because she came over. She was the most beautiful girl at the time that I I had seen in my life that was close to me, next to my body. And ultimately why I fell in love is because she said something so dirty. We was on the phone having phone sex. She had been hanging with me. She wouldn't give me pussy. I didn't understand how to get pussy then. And that fucking girl said to me, she talked like these. I mean, I don't don't want to say no, but she talked like these. And she was like, I, I, you, why you, did you do that and, and you did not fuck me? I go, I said, you was playing games, though. I said, did you want to fuck? She said, yes. I said, was your pussy getting wet? She said, yeah, my panties were wet, right? This, I'm, and she goes, let me ask you, how old are you? I go, what? I'm 28. She's 18. She goes, how old are you? I go, 28. Why? She goes, I knew you were young. And I go, what? I knew you were young. She said, you don't always ask a woman for what she wants. You should have took it, little boy. An eighteen-year-old girl said that to me. <laughs> yeah, that would that, I, that would fill oh, me up. <laughs> I almost I had a tear in my eye, and I was leaving Amsterdam that next morning. Yeah. And I swear to you, you were looking up flights online, dude. <laughs> Let me change that's my the flight. first time I ever got long distance put on my phone, yeah. like international plan. Uh, I paid that extra five just to hope to call her. Didn't she come here? Yeah, but I don't. She wasn't interested. It's just wait. I, you flew her to the states, or she, nah? She didn't. Oh, I didn't okay. fly. She just came. But God, right. she was sexy. Oh, well, we get back to Sam. So we got intern David uh, gets out of the cab in front of the parlor, the massage parlor. Yeah, and you can just tell in his voice and in his actions that we describe how over the moon he is to be there. Right. Okay. Oh, did his poor mama? His oh, poor well. mama fire. <laughs> no, no. We might have to collect the penthouses. We might have to collect them. All right, here we go. Oh, it, <laughs> just, I, 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 you just hear it, right? Oh, yeah. Get, get, get him out of here. You can hear the whole energy has right. just left this radio show. <laughs> You're right, dude. Oh, my God. You are fucking... Look, I would love to look through that magazine right you now. Are being, Trust me. You are being, like a, you're being very correct with the discipline that you're laying out right now. <laughs> I'm dying myself. I am just looking at titties. <laughs> yeah, just, like, really? <laughs> go ahead, Dan. What? Massage bones? Go get him, Tiger. Yeah, a little distraction. All right, here we go. David, we just got out of the cab. How much money did you give the driver? I gave the driver ten dollars. How much was the bill? Nine dollars and thirty cents. Why didn't you give him more than seventy cents tip? I don't know because he gave me two fives and I didn't want to give that much. So I didn't give him anything. I wasn't thinking. I was too busy thinking about the massage parlor to think about a tip. Just had your mind in your balls, huh? Yes, that's correct, Sam. Intern David is out of his mind. <laughs> he his can't voice. wait to get into the massage parlor. When we were oh, uh, he's out of his mind. I got out of the cab. <laughs> yeah. And I realized he was giving him ten dollars and I'd see and I was like, Are you really giving him ten dollars? <laughs> and Dave said, with the door open, sitting with the cab driver sitting right there, he goes, Yeah, do you think I should tip him? And I just started laughing and walked away. Well, let's be honest, though, little Dave. It's one of you. Yeah. Well, <laughs> he's not exactly fighting stereotypes. Yeah, I mean, little Dave is yeah, little he's, Dave. Yeah, he's, <laughs> but he does have a bankroll on him, so he could have probably gave a few extra. Yeah. How much, did, how much did he give him? He wasn't spending his money. He had at no. least... He had at least Really? Yes. Plus, you gave extra cab money. Uh, well, yeah. Cab I, money. I want to make it perfectly clear. I gave him cab money. <laughs> it's on the tape that I gave him cab money. Cab money. That's yes. what we spent it on. Yes. Uh, David describes his ideal masseuse. Yes. He, so he, you, you did a little pre-interview before he went inside, right? Yeah, because I also wanted to know what his expectations were, and he obviously had no idea what type of a place this was. Now, where are we at with David? Like, is he a virgin before this? What yeah. Was, his, his, he's never really... Uh, the most he had gone, the uh, the most experience he had was tongue kissing. He had, Where's he at? Hey, we're getting him. Oh, yeah. Okay. He's getting food or something. He'll be in here. We got enough audio to get us through until he arrives. David describes his ideal masseuse. So, David, what kind of girl are you hoping for? I'm hoping for, 
you know, a nice white, um, white American, regular American girl, with like a nice, a nice body, nice, normal size tit, breasts, not too big, not too small, nice normal size, yeah, yeah oh. and a nice white American girl, yeah. Any color hair or color eye? Probably, probably blue, maybe blue eyes and blonde hair would be nice. <laughs> All right, cool. Just a, <laughs> a wasp. He's, he thought he was going to go into a massage parlor and get a nice blonde hair. Blue <laughs> just, a, <laughs> just safe to say that they don't uh, stock the massage parlors with uh, <laughs> which is with girls which is with blonde hair which is what his, which is what his if if you saw that in a massage parlor you would know it would be an uh, uh, an actual massage. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> like that would you just get a massage. That's there. all you're getting. His excitement was yeah. just so <laughs> not a massage parlor excitement. Oh, I love the innocence of this kid. <laughs> David's first words after Oh, so now we got the interview after the massage. Right, so at this point he went in, I told I re went over everything. Right. You know, exactly what he should ask for, what he should do, blah blah blah. Just go in, go with the flow, do what they tell you, and now, just have a good time. I wrote Sam, I go, All right, how's it going? Because I'm like, all right, an hour's got to be up by now. Yeah. Sam's like, he's still in there. How long was he in there? He spent, from the time he walked in the door to the time he came out the door, was an hour and 45 minutes. <laughs> <laughs> I thought I was just going to go down, get a slice of pizza on the corner, 40 minutes he'd be in and done. out, little in and out yeah. action. An hour and 45 minutes is what he spent in that doesn't place. Doesn't that cost about an hour? He, he, They charged him one hour. Because that he they just probably felt... <laughs> Those one of those well, awful women probably felt like, wow, I get to this is yeah. a guy who's not the usual piece of garbage. I'm gonna really get him. Yeah, he told me after I'm gonna get him hooked. He told me after that the lady asked him how old he was, and he said, I'm 26. This is a test of the emergency alert system. This is only a test. This concludes this test of the emergency alert system. If this had been an actual emergency, the tones you just heard would have been followed by additional information or instruction. We now return you to your serious XM programming already in progress. Where's his vocabulary? He came One out. Yankee crikey. Uh, he came out. And the whole name. The, uh, he, <laughs> that's who he is for rest of the night. It's not even DL or D. No. no it's just DL Hughley. DL Hughley. Right. And he said, is that the proper pronunciation? I guarantee he found out how do you really pronounce it. Is it Hughley or Hughley? Hughley. Oh. And you are going to pronounce that fucker oh. is. You know Listen what? to his crack. Hold on. You're, you're, you're not going to believe this fucking thing, Jimmy. We're in the middle of an emergency uh, uh Oh, they alert. did tell us. They told us. No, no it was supposed late. to happen at 927. So that's why we purposely fucking took a, a commercial break so we could clear the field and play this audio. What the fuck did we... What the fuck did they miss? What the fuck did you guys miss? Someone write me. Where's uh, E-Rock and C-Lessie? Maybe they got the wrong What the face. fuck did they miss? The phones are they used to just do these without telling us. So finally, we're like, "Could you at least fucking tell us so they, so something uh, important isn't being blocked over?" I guess with DC, the EAS test. DC missed it, so they just, I just got the heads what up the saying, "Be prepared." Do these guys even have a job? They can't push a button for an EAS test. Die! The uh, the last thing they heard was David's age. David's age. That was what. Right after said uh, Sam said that they told him that he was twenty six, then off. Now play the audio again. Okay. It's what, basically... what, what clip? So go back to track three, David's first words. Yeah, you didn't, all you gotta do is his first words as he comes out. Yeah, because they heard that he wanted a blonde hair, blue eye. Right, they heard that. So wait, I'm trying to remember. So you said 26. Yeah, that was right before we played the audio sure? of him leaving. Yeah, right. so yeah, go back to track three. Motherfuckers. God. What was this, just one of those emergency broadcast things? Yeah, but yeah. we knew it was happening at 927 because I know people are going to give us hell because we're like, all right, we'll, uh, we'll, we'll go, we'll break, we'll do something different. We'll break right away so the EAS test could, uh, you know, go over some horse shit promo they play a million fucking times. And then we'll be ready to get really, you know, into this bit that's really important. 
We didn't miss anything. Unless I heard it was Dave said he was 26. All right, so Dave, uh, God damn it, leaves the massage parlor and hears his first words. We'll replay this clip. David, uh, you just came out with your windbreaker off. Now, D.O. Hughley made a big deal about the fact that you had a yellow windbreaker, but you were walking down the sidewalk carrying it. How do you feel? Before I answer any questions <laughs> or say anything, I just want to give a big thank you to D.L. Hughley for, for, for paying for this. I, thank you so much, D.L. Hughley. I really appreciate that. That, that. that was incredible. Thank you so much, man. And how about the other guys? Yeah, the other guys, too. Yeah, like, oh, not, yeah, thank the other guys, like Bob Kelly for showing me the place. But D.L. Hughley, man, that, that, that's incredible what he did for me. Thank you so much, man. What a, what, a what, a jerk. Jerk. what a little jerk he is. What a jerk. Unappreciative little cocksucker. He Whatever. thanked DL 50 times. Well, DL, Whatever, everybody DL looked at him and goes, uh, you know what, we got we to gotta get you laid. He made the suggestion. We got to get you a girl. But you pitched in a good whatever, and somebody else, and Bobby, I, here's the thing, it, it's called synergy. Mm -hmm. right. That little motherfucker didn't appreciate the synergy that right. happened. Right, He came out with his hair combed, he was carrying his jacket, even though it was 30 degrees outside, strutting yeah. down the street. <laughs> <laughs> and like I said, he peppered his, uh, his vocabulary with a few mans. Yeah. He just sounds a little hey, more man. confident. And then... To the, to the best of our knowledge, we think this is the first time he, you know, he's. I've asked he him. He had some action with a, a chick. Straight up, he hadn't done anything besides kissing before. Wow, this. we're gonna get him in live, but I want to get through the uh, the interview that uh, Sam Sam went through with like an hour and a half, two hours of audio, and we got the best clips here. Yeah. Uh, David talks about the first thing he saw after he got in. Yes, he was. So he goes into the massage place, and this is what he saw. Right. And then you go into this. You go into this locker room, and you you get undressed. Fully. Fully. The exact, and the exact second I walk into the locker room where they told me to go to undress, there I see a naked man. Okay. <laughs> with his ass. To what? what? <laughs> so he walks in. Yeah. And he goes past the reception area down to the locker room. Yeah. And he's just greeted by a naked man's ass in his face. In the locker room? In the locker room. Yeah, you get a, I don't, that's why I don't like the place. The big communal locker room, that's why I didn't like it. Yeah. A naked man. <laughs> okay. With his ass towards me. Exactly did that, when I walk in. When I walk, exactly when I walk in the locker room. Did that kind of get you started? That, that, I was like, oh, man. That wasn't that. I was like, oh, no, man. I don't need to see that. Because <laughs> <laughs> then he had to go and shower with them and everything. So I, mean, I hated had, that place. Separate showers. But you, you know the place that David went I to? I fucking hated that place. Yeah. Bob told me about it. It was like, fuck, it's all a bunch of... I like privacy, man. I don't want to shower with a bunch of dudes and wait in a fucking line like, like it's an assembly, an auto assembly plant. Right. I just want to sneak in, face down, finger in the ass, jerk off, <laughs> take care. Godspeed. Wow. All right. Uh, David describes the table shower as recommended by Bob Kelly. Right, because you remember on Friday, Bob said... You gotta ask for a table shower. Table shower is the best thing you'll ever experience. Table shower is wonderful. You gotta get a table shower. So I told him to get a table shower. All right. So I lie on the table and I'm like, okay, this is a mas oh, okay, and I guess the massage is starting. No. And what was it? The massage. It's the table shower. Oh, the table shower. The one recommended to you by Bob Kelly. Yes. How was that? Awful. <laughs> Awful. <laughs> Bob Kelly made a big deal about the table shower being this great, wonderful thing. The table shower was nothing. What was wrong with it? What was it? The woman, I was, I, I was undressed, took a towel, she took a, a huge tub of water, poured it on me, <laughs> then told me to turn around, poured more water on me, then told me to stand up, poured more water all over me. And did and you have a towel it. on at this point? No. <laughs> and then that was it. That was it. And then the towel sh table shower was over. So she just came and poured a bucket of water on you? She came and poured three buckets of water on me, <laughs> naked, and that was it. That's the whole table shower, yes. That's it. <laughs> So at this point, he's sitting there and saying, he's, they convinced me that this was this great thing, yeah. and all I have is a locker room full of naked men, a yeah. public shower, and yeah. some woman dumping water on me. And, and you know, David's Jewish. He was, he was exactly. thinking, this is, must, must have been how it was in Auschwitz. Or something. <laughs> and I mean, the great thing, when Bobby would tell me about uh, massage parlors, Bobby's really into the massage. Like... Mm -hmm. You know, when I listen to it, I'm such a thing like, I'm not going there. I want to know about the, the, the whole happy ending. But Bobby's into So when he tells you, dude, you got to get the, the the back rub, I'm thinking, okay, that's the code word for, you know, sucking your balls. But it ain't. It's just Bobby likes to go to massage parlors to get a massage. So you go and ask for the back rub, and then right. they just rub your back. Uh, ultimately, he's thinking, like, DL should have sent fucking this kid to 
some place where it's like, you know, a dick sucking collar. <laughs> Not actual in your window, but like fucking because he's Slow getting. Slow down. <laughs> <laughs> Slow down. Well, I, we'll, I do mean, that. we'll do that next month. Yeah. Like, <laughs> you know what I mean? Up to that like, <laughs> like just, but, that, but you can hear him. The innuendo that yeah. happens at these massage parlors, <laughs> you really don't know. He got like a, a table bath, which is just, it's some Caligula shit without the Caligula. It's the, <laughs> it's some fucking Roman horse shit. Mm -hmm. well, it doesn't, it didn't sound like much of a table shower, just dumping three buckets dumping of water, water all over yeah. him. Some fucking <laughs> Vietnamese girl just pouring some fucking right. New York City tap water <laughs> right. on his little dirty chest. <laughs> Uh, all right, now we go back to the uh, the post interview. David's massage starts. He talks about the conversation he had with the masseuse and demonstrates his quick thinking. Here we go. What's your job? She said. What's your job? Mm -hmm. What'd you tell her? I said I work at a radio station. I I'm an administrative assistant <laughs> at a radio station. <laughs> administrative assistant. <laughs> Jesus. What an ass. It's Woody Allen's embryo. <laughs> <laughs> Wouldn't that make her paranoid? Like, this is the fucking media in my <laughs> joint? We've always told her. What are they doing an expose or something? Never mentioned names. Yeah. So before I went in there, he said, I'm not going to say anything about Opie and Anthony's show. No way. No way. <laughs> right, right, right. <laughs> so right. came down to crunch time, and he's an administrative assistant. All right, here we go. A radio station. Very good, because you didn't want to give her too much information. I said, I said, I'm a, I work at a radio station. I'm an administrative assistant. She said, Oh, how is that? How is that? I said, Oh, it's a good job. I like it. It's a very good job. So, okay, that's good. She didn't give a and fuck. That was pretty much most of the conversation. That was like all the conversation. He could have said, I throw shoes at President Bush, <laughs> and she would have had the same reaction. She didn't listen to a word that idiot said. I sound like a good job. <laughs> right. and he's having a real conversation with her. Oh. <laughs> Oh. <laughs> what do you do, man? <laughs> it's just, he probably gave her a card and yeah. <laughs> here's my I'm card. An administrative assistant. And she said, ah, to everything. What the fuck is an oh. administrative assistant? At our radio station. That's like the worst job on earth. <laughs> Different inflections of ah. Right. Hey, uh -huh. Yeah, I have this much money. Ah. Uh, yeah, I'm running like out. The worst uh. job. <laughs> All right, here we go. David talks about how the massage was. Yeah, he also enjoyed the massage, like Bob and Kelly does. this is does. like a real professional massage. Right. She's putting all the lotions, all the creams. She's moving her hands up and down my body, up my back, on my ass. Yeah. She's moving on my legs, on my feet. Every single, she's moving her fingers on my, in each individual toe, each individual finger. Where on the ass did she massage? She massaged on the whole, on the, up and down the butt cheeks. Mm -hmm. <laughs> And all up and down the legs on the in the crevices of the crotch. <laughs> Did she go Did, in the balloon nut? She she got there. She her fingers grazed the <laughs> that's that area. That's what Bob Kelly said would happen. <laughs> yeah, that if you're lucky, she'll graze your ass. That little taint, that little area. <laughs> and he he seems so new. Yeah, he, you know, she probably was like, "Wow, nice new man's asshole." It was just <laughs> it was all young and delicious for her. <laughs> She's just rubbing it. <laughs> She, her fingers grazed the, that area. The asshole. The asshole, and then her fingers grazed the outer skin of the, of the ball sack. <laughs> the outer skin of the ball sack. Okay. How did that feel? It felt very good. <laughs> <laughs> so he liked being touched on the outer skin of the ball sack. Did you ask him, did you ask him if he filled up? Oh, yeah, later. Oh, okay, okay. Yeah. But he sounds like the, the description he's giving is the same tone a doctor uses when he's telling you where he found tumors and lumps. <laughs> right. The well, outer the, skin the of the ball sack. He would just say the sack, the outer skin of the sack. There was nothing sexy about David's description at all. Yeah. Unbelievable. All right. Uh, <laughs> where are we at here? Uh, eight. Okay, David uh, is asked to turn over. He thinks the massage is over. Right. And she's like, okay, turn around, turn around. I said, oh, you want me to turn around? Yes. And I'm thinking of his, okay, I guess it's over. I guess it's over now. I'm, I'm thinking to myself, I didn't say that out loud. I, I'm thinking to myself, okay, I guess it's over now. She's telling me to turn around. I guess it's over now. Boy, was I wrong. It was not over in the slightest bit. It was not over in the slightest bit. <laughs> the, the, the innocence of this kid is, I mean, I nuts. guarantee he knows how to spell golly G. Willigan. Like, no one, no one ever wrote it down. I'm sure David wrote down golly G. Willigan. Boy, was I wrong. Why well, tell you something? He thought that the grazing yeah. of the 
uh, outer ball sack yeah. was going to be the big thrill of the whole operation. Oh, he didn't. He something uh, horrible he, was coming. He had no idea. Boy, the best was, was he yet to wrong. come. Right. Boy, was I wrong. <laughs> Where is that little bastard at? We're God gonna get him in as soon as this part of, is over. And then we'll get him. Is he? Get look him, at him. He's here. I see him yeah. popping around, but uh, we want to get this audio on the air first. Uh, David talks about the masseuse pleasuring him. Yeah, this is where it gets uh, All right. raunchy. You could tell that I was getting excited. So she started to get slowly and slowly get more and more forceful with her with the, with her hands. Okay. And then after a couple minutes, it turned into a real full fledged hand job. If I can, can I yeah, real hand? <laughs> Have you has he ever had one? No, no, no. that's what we're getting at. He's kissed. He's kissed a girl. That's it. That's right. I mean, she now. is dead. <laughs> Hand There's job. If I can, can I have yeah, real hand job? We we'll just say that, okay? I can say hand job. This is going to air on XM, so I can say hand job. <laughs> and at this point, I'm look super how, excited. Look how arrogant he's getting. Huh? Huh? Yeah, how arrogant he's getting. That motherfucker said, "I know what to say on radio, <laughs> yeah. bitch." Oh yeah, this guy. He's going to be our boss someday. It's just how it works in this company. Hand jobs. This is going to air on XM, so I can say hand job. <laughs> And at this point, I'm super excited at this point. Whoa, I'm super excited. <laughs> <laughs> oh. <laughs> super Jew. He was so excited after all this was happening. Yeah. The post-interview, just the post-interview, took 45 minutes. I understand. Like, he was sitting there talking every detail. Like, the stuff that's not on this tape is him going, and then they asked for my ID. So I gave them my ID. And then they looked at it, and I said, "All right, all, all right, right, let's get to the good stuff." But you gotta, you Edit gotta yourself, love, you dummy. gotta love every second of his experience in this. That he, oh, it's vivid. Oh yeah. yeah, yeah. That's why I want to play this before we get him in live, because this is like right after the experience. Yeah. Uh, David explains he started to get frisky. <laughs> yes, he did. Did he use the word frisky? He sure uh. did. And then I was getting a little frisky at that point. <laughs> 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 Fucking Aunt David. <laughs> wow. <laughs> uh, that, isn't that what? <laughs> isn't that what Marion Ross said before she was gonna yeah. fuck uh, uh, Tom Bosley? Tom Bosley. Bosley. And by Mr. Frisky, Cunningham. by Frisky, he means he grabbed her like De Niro grabbed Ileana Douglas in Cape oh. Fear. <laughs> <laughs> I got you now, bitch. Oh. <laughs> Officer, am I in trouble? <laughs> Bites her face. <laughs> wow. <laughs> His favorite sex scene ever. I got you now. <laughs> He's tolerating her shitty jokes all night. I'm, I'm drinking sea breezes. I hope you can afford them. <laughs> hey, darling. <laughs> uh, t t Tanner in Fargo writes, David is like Borat without the accent. <laughs> <laughs> wah, wah, wee, wah. Whoa. David's saying, wah. Super excited. Should be a sound drop. Yes, okay. He's and so then, vivid, though. You can feel oh, I so love this. Yeah. Wow. David talking about getting frisky here. And then I was getting a little frisky at that point. <laughs> Me. Okay. I was getting frisky. <laughs> what did you do? What's frisky? I proceeded to touch her. You did. Oh, I certainly did. I certainly did. Was it welcomed? <laughs> yes, it was welcomed. Where did you touch her? On her back. Okay. I put my hand on her back and was rubbing her back gently. What? <laughs> I'm gonna. I'm gonna be quite honest. Yeah. His newness, yeah, is is making me like rejuvenate my lack of newness. Like I'm like You're excited wow. for it again. This is exciting. This is, I wish I could. This is like a brand new toy. This day, yeah. I need to watch an Asian girl run around a room with a meatloaf hat in a room full of Komodo dragons. <laughs> His <laughs> happiness is just so. The threshold amazing. changes after a long time. You, you can't. Get excited until it's at a certain point. I can't. I I have to watch. Like like I watch fisting. Like just uh -huh. some guy putting his whole hand in a bitch's pussy. It's like I'm like, oh, there you go. It's filling up now. This is this it's is filling up. This this is so amazing. That this, this is whole the thing. Yeah, this is the uh, beginning stages of sexual perversion. Fast forward a few years, he's gonna be in a dungeon somewhere in high heels, like on his tippy toes, hoping he could like you know. Balance himself so he doesn't choke himself. <laughs> and remember this moment. Remember this moment. I don't know if you you remember this if you're a cartoon watcher, yeah. old school cartoons. Yeah. Yogi Bear and the Chinese, the Japanese bear, the picnic basket bear. You, you remember that episode where the Chinese bear came from? He said, like, look, look, the, the ranger's like, don't feed him picnic basket food. Right. And he said, okay, no problem. And Yogi was like, hey, try this. And the bear just got strung out. 
Pick a big butt guy! And he just starts flipping people over chairs and beating their asses for picnic basket food. Can we find That's that clip? That's this kid. I'm t it's the, it's the Chinese find picnic. That clip in the oh, back. it's great. All right, right. And he, um, it's, yeah. he's, he's him. He comes in there straight laced, and it's over now. He walked out of there, and like I was down the block, so I was meeting him. So we were meeting him. Before I was even close enough to hear him speak, he just stopped, smiled ear to ear, and gave me a big thumbs up. It was great. All right, let's get back to this. So uh, David explains he started to get frisky. We're in the middle of that still. While she was giving me the, while she was giving me the hand job. Okay. And I was really frisky. And I was really getting like super excited. Whoo, oh, oh, super excited, super frisky. So I took my hand and placed it under the under her whatever. I don't even know what the hell she was wearing under. And I was massaging her back underneath her shirt, the back underneath the shirt. And I felt her back and the the back strap of her bra. Did that excite you? It did excite me. <laughs> <laughs> Someone is saying we got to get all this up online. They're, they all should be ringtones. There's a lot of ringtones in here. I want to find a place to air the complete 40-minute interview. Really? Yeah. It's not a bad idea. Maybe a little podcast or I'm something. I'm amazed, yeah. dude. This it's is a little so... Podcast. I don't remember when... I think I got my first pussy at 13. Mm-hmm. And I, But I still wasn't even innocent. I'm, I'm a piece of shit. I think I've always been... And, I mean, this kid, the, the joy of his first fucking piece of... It's just a... It's hand beautiful. job. It's hand job. Hand not job. even ass. I touched her bra. <laughs> <laughs> I tell you... I, he probably just... <laughs> touched can, I, can I tell you an innocent moment that still gets me horny, like, in yeah, terms of, of sexu sexuality? Of course. But it's still creepy, but it's still innocent? Is when a girl it, wants to give you some pussy and... Just watching new panties come down to the part where the ass starts, where it's, it's ha half ass meat and hips, when when you yeah. just know that pussy's about to happen. That that's the still the thing the the the, the regular sex thing that'll still get me is just new getting ready to see new pussy, not mm -hmm. even seeing it. It's fucking I, great! I, I just realized we do have our own uh, channel. We sh we could play the full interview at eleven. Yeah. I mean, we should warn the people. It might get a little slow, but uh, it uh, yeah, points. But I mean, is it it's worth fun? It? Yeah, it, you think it's worth it? Yeah. All right. Can, can you get that? Yeah, I'll do it while, uh, while right. you're interviewing. We'll try to check. play the whole interview at eleven, the long form. Something a little different today. Yeah. What the hell? Uh, David continues to touch the masseuse, and I proceeded to move my hands. Move my hands. Where'd you move them to? To the to the front of her, to her front area. To her stomach. Yes. And. Her breasts. You touched her breasts? I didn't... When I say touched her breasts, I didn't actually touch her, her full, full-fledged breasts. I touched her breasts with the bra, while the bra was on. But under the shirt. On, I touched her breasts under the shirt with a bra on. With, with bra on. And it was welcomed. I, was, I heard. I was grazing. I wasn't like, I wasn't like squeezing it and grabbing it. I was <laughs> caressing it and I was slowly massaging it gently. I wasn't caressing it. I wasn't squeezing it and... And it was welcome, yes. <laughs> <laughs> did, did I can't you, wait to talk to him live. Did you catch that? What part? I'm going to tell you what he was doing. Yeah. He wasn't sure what to do. Mm -hmm. So this motherfucker was being a creep. He was... It was It was the equivalent of looking under a girl's skirt on the train. It's like he was touching places just to see if he was going to be told not to. Right, he didn't know what was allowed. He So he was just being a dirty little sneak. A dirty... Little, st I'm telling you, you opened up some real bad <laughs> shit right oh, yeah. here. I think so too. Just a fucking little piece of garbage. <laughs> I, think, yep. David I think you're right. <laughs> yes, he is. A it's, sneaky little piece of we're garbage. We're starting David out with a little pot, just a little oh, bit, a little taste geez. of pot, and man, he's gonna be a meth head. <laughs> oh, his his first rim job, his first <laughs> full mouth on his dick. <laughs> Oof. He's gonna do one of those warps from Stargate, just <laughs> <laughs> back to Pyramid Time. It's gonna just take him back. To he's gonna end up selling his own body to get money, so he can oh, he... <laughs> continue if down this road. If you can find Picnic Basket, please do. <laughs> yeah, hopefully, we can find it. Uh, David talks about the size of his penis. Yes. All right, we'll skip that track. You're no. kidding, right? Yeah. Why? I was kidding. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Not that I want to hear about his dick. Because <laughs> <laughs> that's what I am wondering, a little Jew boy. I wonder about his, his little circumcised well, knob. Let's, let's guess. Probably Does he say how big it is? He gives a number. You know he's going to lie. I don't think he's lying. No, he actually, I 
I'm going to go with uh, four inches. I, I, bet he's, I bet he's six to seven. No. All right, I Patrice is six to seven. Between five and a quarter and five and a half. You think so? I know. No, you, you How just, do you know? I, know? I can sense by his dumb glasses. All right. Now, now God just, wait, just Jimmy, doesn't what do you make... Say? God does five and a half to things, six and a half. Man. No, five and a quarter to five and a half. Five and a quarter, five, what the? F All right. I, I say he's about six seven. I just think six to seven. Yeah, God just what? doesn't no. do that, man. God will not let that boy have Hell a small dick. Oh fucking no! I'm gonna go. God allows children to have their arms cut off at Calcutta. <laughs> <laughs> Good point. Good point. Very fair. Yeah, very fair. Yeah, All he right. loves genocide, so he'll allow that nah, asshole to have a small dick. He's got nothing. You think I'm, he's going? I'm going nothing. Really? Nothing? My official guess is four inches. And he has. You know what though? You're right because he he doesn't even. Because I know. I bet you Sam's packing because Sam has a he has cock shortness. You know what I mean? He, he like so David doesn't even have that. That assuredness, like he has a big dick. You might be right. Yeah. I'm, I'm drifting no. off of it. I'm still going to stick with six. Six. All right, here okay. we go. And then I was really super excited. Were you packing a full rod? I was packing a full rod. How big would you assume? It was a good close to four and a half, five inches. Oh, okay. Wait, wait, what did he say? Four and a half to five and a half? Four and a half to five, but keep playing the track. Before you give any credit. All right, Jimmy might be leading. I said four. Jimmy said five and a half, pretty much I on the nose. Five and a quarter to five and a half. Yeah. Well, that's close enough. Hold on. And then I was really super excited. Were you packing a full rod? I was packing a full rod. How big would you assume? It was a good close to four and a half, five inches. Okay. It was good. That's because that's my normal, like five. I I pretty much say it five, maybe sometimes five and a half. But you'll max out around five, five and a quarter. Yes. Okay. I will. Yes. Jimmy nailed it. Jimmy nailed it. Yep. Right on the money. Who's the kid? Who's <laughs> yeah. the kid? That's right. I can't. I don't know what stocks to pick. But you show me a fucking intern. I'll tell you how big his dick is from two miles away. You're the who cock has, kid. Who has the biggest dick out of all the interns? I don't know. And I'm asking Norton. He's a he's oh. a dick size expert. You all right? Line them up. Who how many the interns intern? we got today? We got four. Yeah, line them up after the break. I mean, when we bring in the, the your penthouse feel, because that was just a feel, right? Yeah, Dave, yeah. You just had a feel. Yep. Okay. All right, we're gonna line them up, and Jimmy's gonna tell uh, who has the biggest cock among them. Okay. And they should write it down. Okay. Steve, get this going. I already know. <laughs> they hold it to their chest. Jimmy will guess, and then they'll they'll <laughs> reveal. And and I, we don't want any lying by these fuckers. Uh, David gets the two minute warning. What's this about there, Sam? Well, uh, there is a time restriction. To how long you're allowed to be on the you know masseuse table? Okay. And David find, found that out the hard way. All right. And she proceeded to to stroke like, oh yes, yes. I, I, that was me saying, oh yes, oh yes. My arms were both around her. <laughs> like, oh yes, oh yes. I tried. To... <laughs> His arms were around her. <laughs> <laughs> Not gone with the wind, you asshole. You're blowing a load. <laughs> She's paying off a slavery ship debt. <laughs> <laughs> paying off the wolf. <laughs> <laughs> paying off the wolf. <laughs> And he says it like it should be a comic book thought bubble. Yeah. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. He, yeah, she, he absolutely spells it. She just wants to get the uh, the promotion to nails. And, and he's yeah. holding her. Oh, my God. That's so fucked up. The nail promotion. Can I moved to feet now? Oh, oh no, my, and please. I, and I figured out the whole hierarchy. You, you start with the Yankee Cranky shop. Then you go to nails. And then, if you're really lucky, sushi waitress. Nigga, that is the queen of... <laughs> <laughs> right. Third world is, or yeah. or breaking down old computer parts yeah. for the Mercury. <laughs> David gets the two minute warning, and she proceeded to to stroke like, oh yes, yes. I, I that was me saying, oh yes, oh yes. My arms were both around her. I'm like, oh yes, oh yes. I was trying to say that I'm probably trying to make myself go faster, and then she proceeded to say, two minutes left. Two minutes left. And then I proceeded to say, oh, no. <laughs> I said, oh, no. Yeah. He said that out loud? Oh, no. Oh. And she said, yes, two minutes. Yes, two minutes left. And I, so I proceeded to say, oh, moan, and say, oh, yes. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. And she got excited. Okay. No, and she didn't. <laughs> no, she didn't. We got to get David in here. We're we going to. Let We're, him have it, have more, Let him have we it. We will. We have one more track, and then it's David live on the show. I just want to get the the pure innocence of uh, oh, yeah, what him, happened right let after. Him keep the illusion. Yeah. Oh yes, oh yes, and she got excited. Yeah, and she was like, and she kind of looked on her face like, oh yes, and she was really excited. 
if I can say the words that she, can I say the words that she said to me? Yes. She said, "Oh, come, come." <laughs> she said that, not me. She said, "Oh, come, come." <laughs> <laughs> David fucking and I bet you sounded depressed. just like that too. God bless him. <laughs> oh. oh, come C O O M. God love that boy. He, well, he, he was he was convinced that by the way that she really liked him. Yeah. So all right, we're gonna get into all that. One more track here. David talks about making come. <laughs> this is it. But she's like, oh, oh, come, yes, come. And then did you? Eventually, yes, I did. <laughs> yes, I did, eventually. Did you make the two-minute mark? I think it was way past two minutes. I think she <laughs> forgot about the two minutes after that. She, she forgot about the two minutes. Do you think that you just got her so excited that she forgot? I, I, I think so. I think so. Did she clean you up? She proceeded to take another towel, and, and yes, she cleaned me up. Yes, she certainly did. How far did it shoot? If I can be on... Uh, it did not shoot at all. <laughs> did it just kind of gurgle over like a volcano? Yes, it certainly did. It gurgled over like a volcano. Yes, it did. It, no, sh zero. It wasn't a shooting. No shooting at all. All right, listen. There's, there's two <laughs> things going his on. His dick fucking <laughs> vomited like Bon Scott in the car. <laughs> right, right. <laughs> there's two things going on. He either has some kind of medical issue, or this guy jerks off so much there's just nothing going on. It's a lot of on. jerking. Right. It's <laughs> a lot of jerking. Here's what that is. He has <laughs> so much cum rushing to get out. It just bumped into each it, other. It got stuck at the tip. Yeah. It, he wanted to come so bad, his body couldn't, the muscles couldn't tighten. There was and too much cum around. And subsequently, my cum just kind of poured out. His dick hemorrhage. <laughs> <laughs> All right, we got uh, David in studio too, so we thought this would be fun. So we got the penthouse pet of the year in studio, and uh, we got David who just uh, just came for the first time with a woman. Right, Who's David? This motherfucker here, uh, he's new, isn't he? That's Joe. Joe? Yeah. Hello, okay. Joe. Uh, did you write down your cock size yet, Joe? Oh yeah. All right, good. Uh, how are we gonna prove oh, that they're yeah. not lying? Uh, sure, they we got to kind of. You could prove them. Other than that, we have to take their fucking. <laughs> we have to take their word for that. Yeah. Shit. Because if we're guessing on how long they are, then they could be they lying. Are. This you is know? this is David. He, he's he just Hi, got David. his first. Hi, nice to meet you. Hi. What? I heard all about your skanky story. What do you think of it? I think that you're a crazy fucker. That's what I think. <laughs> Thank you. So I think you have a way with the Asian women. <laughs> so the David, Asian persuasion. You enjoyed the uh, the Yankee cranky shop. Definitely, I enjoyed it. Yeah, it was pretty good. I at first I was a little disappointed, but then it. Why it were got you disappointed? <laughs> because bo because a certain individual was making a big deal about the table shower and like that's the best thing you got to get. A the table certain shower. individual? <laughs> yeah. What are you an asshole? Say Bobby Kelly, you piece of shit. <laughs> Bo certain, Bobby was hyping it up, and it wasn't Mr. Shit. Certain Mr. Bob Kelly was hyping, uh, <laughs> was hyping up the uh, table shower, and the table shower was nothing. I but listen, before, before you get all fucked up, David, there's a word called synergy. Now DL said this. Bobby said this, and, and Opie said that, and together, all of that ended up with this wonderful story that we enjoyed. Don't forget that. Yeah. Don't forget we're, that, that. We were all in on this thing. Don't forget for that that table bath was a part of your greatness. A <laughs> part of the, the cab fare and <laughs> everything else that went on to make for a pleasurable experience. Don't for be you. ungrateful, you son of a bitch. Hey, you motherfucker. <laughs> <laughs> so, uh, what else do we want to ask David? Are, are you going to make this a regular thing now, David? I don't know. I mean... Did your mommy and daddy find out? No, they didn't find out. No? Have you been back to see this woman since? No, it's just on Friday. Oh. Yeah. Well, are you going to go back to see her? Is she your girlfriend now? Uh, I don't know about that. I would want to if I could afford it. I mean, it's, a, it's kind of expensive, what was the, but... What was the best part? Uh, bes besides, like, the cumsies, I guess. I mean, what was the best part of the experience? What was <laughs> the cumsies, man? <laughs> well, I understand that, but, like... I, I, I understand that, but I guess... Come, like, <laughs> yeah, that's true. You were hoping the shower was going to be uh, amazing. I was hoping the shower was That good. sucked. What was the best? Oh, other than the cum Yes, like, that's the obvious. What would you do again at a massage parlor other than the cum What was the, the moment where you're like, holy crap, well, the that's whole, cool. The, whole entire, the like, tickling of the asshole. The... the whole entire massage was pretty incredible. Like the way she did the, performed the actual massage, like with the... the you know, the pr different points on the body and the was it like, pressure or, pressure pressure points or was it all? bullshit? Well, it, it felt good, like you felt relaxed after. I did feel relaxed after, yeah. It was. The whole entire massage was actually really good, a really good experience. Yeah. yeah. 